What is up, everybody? Welcome back to NFL action from 20 years ago, uh, right here in the year 2022 on YouTube.com slash Horace Rex. That's right. Through the power of the internet and various other technologies, including laptops, Elgato, game capture devices, a, a HDMI or RCA to HDMI converter, uh, the internet, OBS, you can watch digital football every Tuesday right here on youtube.com slash Rex. So be sure to scroll down, subscribe, ring the bell as we are winding down this season and we are getting closer and closer to the playoffs. Uh, we have some good matchups today. So sit back, relax, grab a snack, hang out, throw this on in the background while you're vacuuming, do whatever you want to do, do whatever you got to do. I love, I love putting on just, just putting on a stream and just letting it, letting it go, you know, just letting it roll. In this case, a YouTuber video. Uh, anyway, hey, we have uh, four games as we do every week. We have four games and I will tell you what those games are right now. We have a couple of divisional, three uh, divisional matchups for you today. I dropped my controller somewhere and I don't know what I did with it. Remember that? Remember when you had corded wired controllers? I was gonna, I said corded, but I meant wired. Um, oh, by the way, this is a series uh, that does a air every Tuesday. But the whole point of this series is that we did a, uh, a fantasy draft in the very first episode. So the teams are all mixed up. Everything's all jumbled. And we're having some fun with it. We are in, obviously in week 14. So there are 13 other episodes that you can watch. Each of them runs about three hours, depending on overtimes and how much I talk. Uh, we are going to jump in first game of the day. I know we just had the Patriots on last week, but we haven't seen the Browns in a while. And these are two good teams with two good records. So that is a, a game worth watching in the AFC. Maybe some playoff uh, seating positioning uh, in contention here. We are then going to move to the Seahawks and Broncos. Both of these teams are playing well. Um, I believe they're both seven and three and maybe they're, maybe they're six and four. They're both on the outside of the playoffs looking in, in a very tight, um, AFC West. We're actually going to see four of the five AFC West teams in this, in this episode today, but the Seahawks and the Broncos can make a push to get themselves into the playoffs. We'll see how that fares today. Then we're going to go to Lambeau field. That's right. We have not been to Lambeau yet. My favorite team. Uh, it took me 14 weeks to get them to Lambeau, or to get us to Lambeau, but they are playing the Bears. The Bears currently lead the NFC Central. The Packers are just behind them. That tie has them at 8-3-1, and one, whereas the Bears are 9-3. and three. So we'll be able to watch that game. The Bears won the previous matchup in uh, Chicago, Champaign, wherever they play, uh, and we learned all about their magnificent stadium. Then we're going to what I think is going to be, or what is the best game on paper? Chiefs taking on the Raiders in the AFC West. Four first place in the AFC West. Both teams nine and three. Very exciting stuff. Uh, and that'll uh, that'll do it for the games today. We'll hang out. We'll talk a little bit. We'll watch some football, and uh, just have a have a good time. We're going to jump into. The first game right now will allow the CPU to fix the roster and we'll, uh, we'll jump on in to game number one. Thank you so much everybody for joining me today. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it's a good one. Last week's video, I will say, I appreciate people who watch it. The games weren't the most entertaining. So I do try, I'm, I'm going to try to bring Foxborough. topics. Ooh, Reclaim yes. A lovely snow game here in game Foxborough. That's fantastic. Uh, I do try to bring some topics here. Uh, there's a lot going on in the sports world right now. Um, so we'll, we'll talk about a couple things throughout the show today. Uh, and I specifically mentioned liking just throwing on streams because I was just watching Bruce Green's stream. And he was talking about how he has some friends throughout uh, kind of the media spectrum who uh, really look down on Twitch. And... Uh, a lot of people used to look down on YouTube and stuff like that, and it's like kind of weird. Like they kind of like 
turn their nose up. You're like, oh, that's not real. And it's like, what are you talking about? How much, how much garbage do you, TV do you have on in the background while you're doing something else? That's just what a stream is. And it's not that streams are garbage. It's just, it, it doesn't make any sense. It's not a, it's not a good argument. You know? You throw it on. You do whatever. You watch it. Sometimes you intently watch it. Sometimes it's just a lovely bit of background noise. I don't know. Nothing to, nothing to look down on. Just because people think that films aren't and all this stuff. I just double check where my camera was supposed to be. Doesn't mean that. You know, people who make three, four hour streams aren't doing anything worthwhile. Hell, I would be honored if you if you throw on like a video and you go, oh. Sean posted a new video today. His new sports video is up and you're doing whatever. Hell yeah. That's cool. That's totally cool. All right. First possession of the game goes to the Browns. No, it doesn't. It goes to the Patriots. I was paying very much close attention. So much attention that I stumbled over all of my words. In the snow, they'll run off the left side. Not a whole lot of a... Uh, no, not a whole lot of room to run. The thing is, he didn't probably sw swing left uh, enough. Donovan McNabb, Deuce Staley, Ed McCaffrey. The trio for uh, New England. As I left my other Xbox and soundbar on. Second down. Patriots. Currently sitting, like currently actually right here. Second I don't know if I, I don't know if I've mentioned this. Uh, I have every generation of Xbox console. I guess it, except for a Series X. I have one of each of the generations of another run off the right side. The pathing, not great running into a lot of, of offensive linemen, stuff like that. Kind of frustrating. Al Harris, uh, Green Bay Packer. But I have an Xbox over here. I have a 360 over here. My monitor is sitting on top of an Xbox One, and then I have an Xbox Series on top of that Xbox One. But I think we're at the point where I don't really need my offense has to be thinking I don't really need my Xbox the football, one but the defense at the moment. This. That gives the Most of the stuff I've bought recently has been digital. The last thing I was using my Xbox One for was NBA. That series is done. Will pass. There's a nice find in the snow. Donovan McDab, no stranger to snow, played in Philly for a number of years. Made the tackle. First down, First New England. Can. Man in motion. And so far, a pretty efficient drive for the New England Patriots. So they'll work with a play action. They're going to throw it deep. That's an easy completion. He got turned around, but he has pull away speed. Touchdown to open the scoring for New England. Love the play action there. We see this pretty frequently. If a, a receiver can get behind a defense like that, even with that turnaround, I thought the turnaround would slow him down. Typically, it's a pretty easy touchdown run, but we have seen some bad throws lead to uh, defense's ability to catch up to them. New England played a great game last week against the New York Jets. If you want to go back and watch that, it is the best of the four games that we had. Um, as most of them were pretty lopsided affairs, but, uh, you know, brought some topics in, talked about some stuff, had a good time. And just, you know, just enjoy just enjoy it, you know. The kickoff is in the air. We've hit daylight savings time. Gordon We're a week into daylight savings field. time. And uh, that return was worth I guess it's going to be permanent starting Solid next year. So, you know, You're who cares about time? This is a great matchup of quarterbacks here. Dante Culpepper, Donovan McNabb, Ladanian Tomlinson as a running back for some reason doesn't have a picture. Hopefully we get you know, a the good game. Games can be 19. good, both high scoring and low First scoring. And I believe I, I left my phone over there again. I was going to check some scores. March Madness, obviously the big thing happening right now. Oh, a nice move off the right side. And Tomlinson is free down the sideline. Runs into the defender at the 45-yard line. And that is a great start for the Cleveland Browns. Cleveland Browns in the news. Not in a positive the way. And they paid a dude two hundred and thirty million dollars, uh, fully guaranteed. 
who uh, currently has 22 outstanding, uh, what is it, accusations of uh, sexual assault. So, first down, <laughs> Cleveland. Cool, cool. First and ten. Cleveland released a really dumb statement today, so I thought about maybe not highlighting them, but then I was also kind of like, well. Nice game by the Browns. Well, nice play. You the man, you the man, baby. You know, maybe just say that it's really dumb that uh, Watson down, gets Cleveland, paid that amount of money. Minutes left in this quarter. First and ten. Over five years. I was reading a tweet that said that uh, it's like 200 and it's 230. And even if he gets suspended for a season, it's still like 229. So they're only going to find him like a million. He'll only lose a million dollars. So cool. The NFL, very, uh, very forward thinking organization. I wish the Browns hadn't got him because they ruffled, you know, they ruffled Mayfield's feathers. Uh, and then and criticized him of not buying, like being uh, uh, the leader that they were looking for, and he was like, "Oh, I want out. This is the this relationship too far gone to mend. I don't care. Like I'm done." Uh, and it would have been nice if they had not also gotten the quarterback that they wanted, and they could just uh, sit there in their own misery. That would have been nice. However, I do think that even with Deshaun Watson, uh, I do think they're probably still the third best team. In that division, I don't see that being enough of a, enough of a change. And, uh, surprisingly, no pass interference call on that one. Receiver got tangled up, but I guess it happens. Uh, I would. I'd say the Ravens or the Bengals. I don't know what the Steelers are doing at quarterback. I uh, know I do. I do. It's. Uh, Trubisky, right? Until Trubisky's going to, to the Steelers. Looks for running room. Maybe he has Warwick a little bit of a resurgence, a, a nice restart. Never really caught on in Chicago. Backed up Josh Allen in Buffalo for a year or two, something like that. The I think it was just a year. At the 22. But now he'll be there in Pittsburgh. I think Pittsburgh just lost... Smith Schuster. Staley runs so, I don't know. We'll see what uh, we'll see what kind of nice magic run. Mike Tomlin can do. I think Mike Tomlin, good coach. Up. I don't like the Steelers personally, but you can't hold me, I like boy, Mike you Tomlin. Second down. I expect Patriots. the Bengals to build on their success from last year. Uh, I would expect the Ravens to be in the mix. Lamar Jackson was injured for a lot of last season. Um, <laughs> And I hope he gets. I hope. I hope McNabb Lamar Jackson's back, back to his original form. To he is it's a nice sack Coach by Cleveland. The line uh, back in the Patriots up here. And the didn't react well as the, the snow first. continues down, to fall Patriots. on this the seven nothing game. Like third down and nine. A quick first down. quarter. They Very efficient first quarter for each each team. Not really dropping passes or anything. Even one pass for Cleveland was like a throw to the flat, and it was still caught for no game. We'll see a nice float pass there. We'll be tackled short of the first down, so we'll start quarter number two with a punt. Time has expired here in the first quarter. The first quarter is over. Three oh two to one fifty seven. Patriots. Black and eight. Fourth and three. Patriots dominating the ball here in the first quarter. Good stand by Cleveland's defense. The kick is away. He punts. It's like we got pretty heavy Warren wind coming in because that was looked like it was a pretty good field. kick. It's gonna get a little bit of room here on the left that side. He didn't return. cut it or he didn't go yards. wide enough towards the sideline to give himself at least a little bit of an opportunity to use some speed along the boundary, but that's uh first down, Cleveland. That's how it goes. First down for first Cleveland. Down. They have fantastic starting field position with uh oh Madden 2002 cover athlete Dante Culpepper. I I think I've had the Cleveland Browns on a couple of times. Uh I, I want to say this is their fourth appearance in the series. 
I forgot that he was on the cover of Madden 02. Madden 2003 is the first year that has the uh, fantasy draft option. I own every Madden from like 1996 to 2020 or something absurd. No gain on the play. That was crushed after no gain. The defense gets an A on that play. Warren made the stop. I got to do some I need to do some spring cleaning. I just have a bunch second of down. random wow. piles of crap that I, I really don't need. It's second down. Really do not need. Including a big pile of Madden games. Man in motion. There's a big pile of Madden games. Uh, there's a big pile of various like other throw. sports games. Like your NFL Fevers, your NFL 2Ks. Uh, a couple of game days. A few game days, actually. Um... I think there's a quarterback club third mixed down, in there somewhere. Brown. I think the defense has got to like its chances of holding the offense on this third down. The safeties just have to make sure that no receivers get behind them. Third down and 8 for Cleveland. Throwing this terrific starting field position away if they can't convert here. They will come up a yard short. But the officials rule he was not in bounds. Oh, just kidding. Uh, they're going to call that an incomplete pass and it will be fourth and eight. So I was kind of curious because I thought he got his feet down inbounds. I don't think the animations are great on the sidelines. It seems like it's kind of a coin flip. Like some, sometimes it looks like a catch. It's not a catch. Sometimes it looks like it wasn't a catch, but it was a catch. It's very weird. Um, oh, we had an opportunity to stop that kick. He chased the receiver or returner away or as he ran up. Uh, was curious if... Cleveland would want to go for it on the fourth down. The Obviously, the incomplete pass negates any sort of decision with that. Back, idiot. Back. They're going to throw. The oh, McMahon with a nice ball. run off the right side. He's going to get the first down. The line was crushed on that play. He picked up 10 yards. Excellent play. Glad we're getting a, a weather game down, happening here. Seems like it's always been super hot and Split balmy. Backs. Maybe it's just the pick places I've picked. Back, Might we have a bit of snow in the forecast the for... Ball. Oh my goodness. Oh no, this is all going to be for nothing. The clock's been it's going to probably be a hold a here on the Holding offense. The offense. Oh... It's going to be first and 20 instead of first and, and 10. First down Patriots. That was a very nice run. Made possible by the hold. Richardson runs it. So first down and 20. I love the fullback run here. He picked up nine yards. Pick a big or uh, pick up a pretty good chunk of yards there. Back of Falcon. Second down, Patriots. Second and 11. Second down and 11. So they got nine of those Man 10 motion. penalty yards back with the fullback run. He drops back to pass. Not much there on that pass play. That pass is a little bit lower. It's been obviously much easier for him to turn up and get some uh, get some yards on that play. And the jump Third slowed down, him down. Patriots. As it sits, gain of four. Third and seven. Halfway through quarter number two. Black, idiot. Hot, hot, hot. The clock's been stopped. We, do we have a false penalty. start or do we have an encroachment? Oh, no. That is two penalties for the Patriots down, on this drive. Patriots. And this was a really good looking drive. They got a nice run from McDowell. They just need the to run sure that they, they had off the right side obviously helped by the excuse me, helped by the hold. But They're going to throw. Staley There's a nice find the out the uh, out to Fifth the left side. McWhorters already has five tackles. We are halfway through the second quarter, and this guy already has five tackles. Good for him. 
Fourth down, Patriots. Just Fourth down and eight left in this on, coming up after this uh, two-minute warning. That's right. We are already at the two-minute two warning. In the first half. Fourth down, Patriots. Second punt of the day for Richardson. The kick is away. McQuarters looks for running room. Oh, McQuarters got to go. No, further out, further out. You can get around here. You can, well, they turned it back return. inside. He Not great, but. Yards. That return has given the offense great starting position. Averaging 11 yards of return for the season. And again, setting up Cleveland with fantastic field position. Uh, okay. The drive begins. Not that I don't love your stats there, McCorders, but sometimes it gets uh, a little confusing. Why it just kind of holds on, holds on that for an extra couple of camera cuts. We might have a false start again. No, wrong way. First down, Cleveland. First and fifteen. Cleveland will go from the I formation. He's going to throw it. The quarterback. Oh, nice run here by Dante Culpepper. Both quarterbacks finding some room off that right side. Getting those penalty yards back plus a few more. Second down, a medium coming up. Second down, Brown. Second and six. Second and six. Will throw. Nice They're find right measure. at the first down. Marker should get a measurement here. He'll be short. And it's That's short. about half a yard. Third and inches. Third and inches. We gonna help you measure your pains. <laughs> Culpepper is going to pass. Down he goes. He lost five yards. The defense schemed that one. Y'all ain't ready. That led to the sack. Great time for New England to come through with a sack there. That'll take a fourth, uh, fourth well, third He's inches, third and half a yard. Turn it into a fourth down and six in the waning seconds of the second quarter. Hendrick gets the kick away. You know, I, I really thought we would see more scoring here. That We're going to have a fantastic punt. There was no so I think that'll take out any real consideration of New England Being trying to drive this football down the, the field in the snowstorm. New England obviously scored game. on their first drive, big bomb down the field. That is all well and good. And the, the ensuing Browns drive started with a first down and a nice run. But unfortunately, they couldn't keep that momentum going. I thought maybe a little more back and forth. Instead, it's turned into a defensive game with the only defensive laps being the big 60-yard touchdown. Cleveland might still get a shot here. They probably should have taken a timeout, considering that they had three of them. Um, they would have had very good field position. Or at least try and maybe get a field goal. Instead, New England will uh, run this clock out, and we'll head to half 7 nothing. That's it for the first half. With our score, 7-0, New England. Cleveland is waiting for the kickoff. Oh, interesting. There's the kick. The field uh, has a different... I was curious the if the field, field would look field. different at, uh, at halftime. That return was worth 19 huh. yards. Wasn't Booker New England the place where the uh, that snowplow kick happened? The drive begins at the 33. First and 10. It's a run. Nice run by the fullback, nice blowing run. up a defender he there. Picked up Picking yards. up five. Second down and medium coming up. Today we are drinking a Snapple apple. Second down, Browns. Second and six. Pay attention. This ain't can't stop. 
Oh, we had a, we even have a, a, a real fact. 230, 236. The quarterback keeps the ball. He got past the first down marker. looking at me. Oh, okay. I'm glad that I read that a couple of times. It's not super First like well lit. Brown. It's just this the ring light on my webcam. Uh, but real fact, number two thirty six. Cows give more milk when they listen to music. So there you go. Real fact number two thirty six for you. Seven yards. I'm glad that I read that. I read that a couple of times. Uh, because I, I thought that, that they were saying that cows give more milk than music that they Second listen to. Down. And I was like, yeah, wow. how many people are hooking up headphones to cows so they can hear music? I formation. Not what they meant at all. Culpepper looks downfield. Culpepper? That connection was enough for a first down. Finds that Play weird good for nine yards. That was weird 180 sweet. degrees with no momentum down. loss. I don't know if it's like a glitch. If you would qualify as a first glitch down, or Browns. gameplay court. First and ten. Man in motion. Cleveland making a good run here. Nice move by Tomlinson. Dodge the first tackle. Got a good, uh, made a good gain there. Second down, Browns. Second down and five. Second and five. Can Cleveland tie this up or even just get on the board with some points? We'll just have to keep watching. Off the left side. Oh my goodness. Wide open field in front of him. He got tripped up. I was moving my hands to signal a touchdown and he got tripped up. So we'll just pretend that I was adjusting my glasses the whole time. Those are set. Those are ready. First down, Browns. It's first and goal. Cleveland will go from the I formation. Wow, what a stop by New England defensively there. It uh, did matter. Rob Conrad gets the touchdown. Two attempts, five yards, one touchdown. Tomlinson does a lot of the work, does not get the payoff in the touchdown department. But that is okay. Remember when the San Diego Chargers went 15-1? and one? Wild. Remember when Green Bay went 15-1? and one? It looks like the offense will kick the extra point. Wow. It's in the air. And it's good. The kick was good. We have a pretty good game here on our hands. Some good offensive drives. Some good defensive stops. New England is waiting for the kickoff. The kickoff is in the air. Rogers looks for running room. Oh, the spin move. Return covered 19 yards. Tackle by Kinney. The drive begins at the 34. First and 10. Black and eight. Staley runs it. Oh, nice run there by Staley. I thought that was actually a play action pass. Nice establishment of the run. Right up the middle, picked up four Second or five down. yards. Uh, three yards, excuse me. I don't know how to count because I didn't know how Second far he went. Pitch out to the left side. He has all kinds of room. Just got to keep nice moving up the field. Actually, yards. a pretty nice Not pitch. I say it every down. week. Those typically nice don't work, work but it seems like they're down, working better lately. However, I do think the snow helps the offense a little bit here. But you can really see. That's a, that's the perfect example, that last play. The perfect example of what is so weird about the padding. is they, It was wide open to the left side, and it kept just... No ducking game. back and forth oh, for no well reason. Absolutely no reason. And uh, 
That's uh, that's Second off. Down, MLB The Show 11. Down. That was on the channel yesterday. Back MLB The Show 12 Made should be on the channel uh, today, I believe. Recording this on Sunday. 10 went up. Monday, 11. Oh my gosh, huge hole up the left side. He's going to get tackled from behind, but New England. He covered 25 have they yards. thrown the ball on this drive? They run up the he middle. The There's a pitch to the, the left side. First down, Patriots. That'll take That's care of, uh, of quarter number quarter. three. The we are burning tied. through seven this one, seven. which is uh, good news for me. Because I am burning through topics of discussion. Very even time of possession. The total down. yards after that Cleveland... Uh, uh, drive for the touchdown that evened up a little bit, but still both teams playing very efficient football. There's a throw right over the middle. I love that. Love that throw. Love that pass right there. Uh, personally, when I play like a Madden, I love a, just a like a curl. I don't know exactly what it would call it. angle, an angle route from the uh, from the running back. Second Just have him go inches. out, in, sit in the middle, dump it for five yards. Three, five. Heck yeah. Second down in inches, all kinds of space. Turned left for literally no reason. I love plays like that. First down. First and goal. Cleveland's defense needs to slow New England down a little bit. They can't get a first down before the end zone. Just kidding. They can't. I'm an idiot. I apologize. First and goal. Oh, my goodness. A little surprised to not see McNabb run. There was a lot of snow-covered green uh, in front of him. Instead, he threw back across the field to Just McCaffrey, who got lit up as soon as he game. touched the ball. Second down, Patriots. Second and goal. I think that's a... The snow threw me off. We'll go with that. The pass is nice incomplete. deflection by the defensive lineman for Cleveland. Very quickly now, it's third down and goal. The Patriots doing... Cleveland a favor by not down, uh, not the running the ball right. and keeping the clock the moving. The Instead, they've had two incomplete passes, stopping the clock. Able to save some time for Cleveland's response drive, depending on what happens here. Now McNabb will run, but that was an excellent defensive play call by Cleveland. They sent one extra uh, one extra defender, or one more defender, I should say, than the offense could even one-on-one -on -one block he'll come through get the sack drop him six yards and set up a fourth and 15. this field goal might pull left it is going to pull left it is no good it is no good wow wow there was no reason for him to miss that was a chip shot field goal even in the snow, you got to be able to make that. The drive begins at the 22. First and 10. Red, 88. Man in motion. Tomlinson with the ball. Nice he run up the middle to get this drive started. Cleveland just needs yards. three. Second down, Browns. Still a lot of time left in the final quarter. Second and five. Cleveland obviously has their entire playbook Man open to motion. them. It's a pass. Oh, we got the sacked. Defense gets to the quarterback and he's sacked. I'm sure the quarterback wants nice to Nice defensive play by New England. I don't blame okay. him for being hot after that okay. sack. Third down, Browns. Third and one. Single back formation. The quarterback drops back to pass. Had a man. I don't like I the throw there. I mean, it didn't matter. He could have 
held on to it, he would have gained three yards. Fourth down, Browns. That'll it's stop the, the clock. 2.32 to go, go here in the fourth quarter. Today. The punt is in the air. Warwick starts up field. Oh, didn't punt. block that long enough. I thought this might have. I thought that might have been something. The way he started to spring to the right, but the game again, just letting him go after a certain amount of time, allows that to be uh, First down, Patriots. First not as good a return as it probably should have been. New England starts in Cleveland territory. Thunder two and a half to go. Pitch out to the right. Nothing doing. That's a five-yard loss. We'll be back at midfield. Second down and 15. Both defenses stepping up here. New England should have this game. They should be winning this game. Second down, Patriots. We'll probably get the two-minute warning here before. The officials have stepped in to give the two minutes. Before the second down and 16, actually. Second down, Patriots. It's second down. Three, five. It's a run. It's a run. Off the right side, not doing a whole lot. Don't love the play call there. Third down in 12, 13 coming up. Third down, Patriots. There's, they shouldn't be content with going to overtime. McNabb finds, throws deep into a lot of it's coverage, and that's going to be just an arm punt. That interception was by Paris. Maybe, Al maybe Harris. Just run the ball. That was green. He made that was a, that was a terrible throw. That was there was some collision at the top of the Paris. route now as the things were try, uh, people were trying to converge. And I think the the, uh, the Patriots Cleveland. player got really tangled up there, allowed First Al Harris a pretty easy interception. This time, the defense lines up in a 34 front. If you can do it right, there's some huge holes to run the football. Culpepper no reason throw. to throw or run the football here. Tomlinson nice the ball start to this first drive. Down. First down. Nice play. It was worth see if we see any timeouts yards. here. Big pickup, big first down for the offense. Culpepper, what do you have for us? First down, Browns. First, first and 10 first from the 28. Granted, you know, they, they have a very long way to go. Be afraid. Be very afraid. Culpepper is going to pass. The pass timeout, is anybody? Anybody? Vicious. He picked up seven yards. There's a timeout. Timeout called by the visitors. Cleveland still has two timeouts. Second down, Browns. 53 seconds. That's a lot of time. A couple of timeouts in their back pockets. Man in motion. Sure, New England more than willing to let them dink and dunk their way down the field like that. The uh, incomplete pass may actually be a benefit to Cleveland here. Third down, Browns. It's third down. Man in motion. Culpepper looks for a receiver. Oh, big bomb down the right side. Incomplete. Most likely a hold here. Oh, white point of the wrong way. It's incomplete. This ball game is nearly over. Fourth down, Browns. He's averaging just over 30 yards per punt today. The punt is in the air. Warwick calls for a fair catch. The drive begins at the 32. First and 10. 40 seconds to go. Hey man, can you throw like that lane on your back? Get you. Oh, 
Oh, look at these short little uh, flat passes are not good. It's not what you want to see here. Second down, Patriots. They will take their first of three timeouts. 31 seconds to go here in the fourth quarter. for a receiver oh. oh dangerous pass there nice deflection by cleveland at al harris again on the defense third down patriots 28 seconds left With the way these teams are hunting the ball they might end up being a field position game here right at the end cleveland still has timeouts in their back pocket 28 big seconds, more than enough pass. time. There's a big That's float a pass. That That's a catch. Boy, there is no that definition between uh, sideline and Look at him field of play. First down, New England. First and ten. Duo receivers to your right side. McNabb He's rolling. Rolling. Fires almost intercepted. Pass. That like looked like it was gonna get picked, but we saw the other day someone tipped it into the receiver's hands. I thought that might go into the receiver's hands as well. Both Second teams very of uh, very pretty cold from a throwing perspective. New England Man probably needs another 30 yards realistically. McNabb is going to run. He's going to get tripped up. He fell down in the backfield. A defender that like tripped immediately out of the blocks ends up getting credit for the sack. Third down in 16. This is a game that New England should have won. They should have won this game. Man in motion. McNabb is going to pass. They're going to measure it. Okay, first down for New England. First down, New England. But that'll do the it for regulation. Comes to a close first with our ten. score seven to seven, and we're heading for an extra session. So pretty good start here. Very Your even stats. Captain, what's your choice? He called Nats. It is Nats. Cleveland wins the toss and elects to receive. So Cleveland will New get the ball England first. Put the ball in play. Only in this uh, situation because the Patriots missed a field goal. Peterson Should have been made. Foot into the ball. I'm not Fontenot an NFL kicker, but man, here goes Cleveland. One of the up men getting the, the ball. No one can tackle him until someone yards. finally obliterates him. And they'll get out to uh, almost the 40 yard line with a pretty poor, uh, pretty poor kickoff. It's first down at the 38. First and 10. Culpepper looks downfield. Culpepper finds a man on the right side, making a move. Would have been a great opportunity for a spin move right there. That first down allows the offense. But a big first down for Cleveland. On the field. First down, Cleveland. Keep in mind this is true sudden death. Field goal in the overtime period. Will win it for the kicking team. In this case, Cleveland, they have the ball. Nice run off the left side. Finds a first down. It'll be inside the 45, down to about the 35-yard line. That was a big gain for the Browns. I like that. First down, Browns. First and 10. Red, 22. 
Pitch out to the left side. Nice run by Tomlinson. He'll get near the first down marker, depending on the spot. We'll see. Uh, Number 21 always seems to make big plays at the right time. The stop was by Paul. First down, Browns. They didn't even measure. Never mind. Oh, I like the run. I like the, the I like the call there. I like the design. There was a hole he could drive a truck through, uh, and he ran right into his own offensive lineman. Second down, Brown. Second down and eleven. About two minutes have elapsed in the overtime period. NFL and their terrible overtime rules, looking to strike again. Got. No rushed. On the play. Now we're getting into Sweet. some dicey Great territory play. here. The computer in this game does not like kicking the ball from this deep, typically. Down, uh, even though it's only like a 40-yard field goal or something like that, it is... It might... We might see a punt. Will pass. The officials are going okay, I think we'll actually, change. this time... We actually should, with that nice completion up the right sideline, we should see a should see a field goal here. Line up for a field goal attempt. The kick is up. It's no good. Oh my goodness! Especially after they miss one. Oh, it just kept going left. New England lives after their own missed the field goal. At the 22. We might end up with a tie. New England, I think, already has a tie on the season. New England will go from the I formation. Man in motion. And if we get a tie here, it'll be the first out of division tie. I think the Patriots and the Colts, they tied. They're in the same division. The Packers and the Buccaneers tied. They are in the same division. Oh, man, did I hurt you like that? Second down, Patriots. The officials have stepped okay. in to give Second the two-minute warning. Second down, Patriots. Play a stop for the two-minute warning. Back, idiot! <laughs> McNabb will pass. They're going to measure it. Be just short and of the first short. down marker. Third and inches. The clock will wind as we're under two minutes Third to go. Four receivers line Great up for first the game going on here to lead off Back. the week. Yeah, he's going to try and find some room off, room off the left side. He has all kinds of room. He'll get up to the 45-yard line. And both quarterbacks have been able to find a little bit of room to run every now and again. First down, New England. New England probably in that... Uh, Split backs for New England. I don't know. 30, 30 yard range before they get into realistic field goal range. That's a good chunk of it right there. First down, New England. First and 10. He's looking to throw. McNabb, big float pass over to the right Green side. That'll be a catch. The, the pass went for a gain of nine yards. The That'll stop the clock. Green. See, I don't know if he got both feet down on that one there. That one there right there. I don't think he got that, them their feet down. Second and inches. 41 seconds Second to go from the 33-yard line. One we went to making seven. a nice drive here late in this game. A game both kickers are going to want to forget. He's, looking to throw. He's going to get McMahon sacked in the backfield. He went down at the Timeout. 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 Anybody? The quarterback didn't have a chance. New England's going to let the clock run like they're content with a Third down, content with a tie. Teams. Throw. McNabb throwing. He has a wide open receiver on the left side. He's going to throw it deep into the end zone. It's going to be dropped in the end zone. 
Oh my goodness! He had a receiver wide open on the left side. One guy defending two receivers had to make Fourth a choice. Down, Patriots. This will be his third punt today. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. It dropped Richardson in the end zone. McWhorters calls for a fair catch and call for a fair catch. I uh, yards. Okay. The drive begins at the 14. Two seconds to go here for Cleveland. Wide receiver set for Cleveland. Red, 22. Man in motion. <laughs> Culpepper will throw. Fires over the middle, and we have a tie game. We have a tie game today, folks. New England 7, Cleveland 7. New England scored on their first drive. Obviously nothing past that. Missed a field goal uh, in the fourth quarter. That Cleveland looked like they were going to eke out a victory in overtime. Seven to they seven. missed a field goal as well, so a 7-7 seven, seven, uh, score is your final Rod and I have picked from uh, the from Foxborough. I will mute my Wilson camera so you can enjoy the Taco work. Bell highlight reel. Taco Bell, where gamers get diarrhea. Let's take a look at the Taco Bell highlight reel, spotlighting key plays from this game. Now on the screen are the stats from this game. Wow. Well, this one is over, and on behalf of Ron and myself, thanks for joining us. Be sure to come back real soon and play NFL Fever again. We're going to watch NFL Fever again real soon, and it's going to be right after this loading screen. Uh, we are heading to Denver. We're going to go get, we're going to go join the Mile High Club, everybody. We're going to go to Denver and watch AFC West division rivals square off in our equivalent of a Sunday afternoon game. New England in the morning. Except for when Tom Brady was there because they always were like, we need New England on all the time. Sunday afternoon. Welcome to Denver. You get home we're from church. Here for, today's for some reason it's 62 game. degrees here, but it was 30 and, and the whatever. I'm Dick Stockton, you know from church. The action with me is Catch a Seahawks NFL game. Player Ron Pitts. Hello, everybody. How Bam. you doing? Ron, who are the players you think will make the difference? That was the end of the uh, very of exciting the explanation. Now, stats don't lie. He's having a great season. He's been a force. A force with a lot of attitude. Here's a guy who never gets tired of seeing passes thrown his way. He wants to catch everything. And that's why Ten his yard name average is found for on Johnny top of the list of receptions. He's obsessed with getting his hooks into the ball. Obsessed. The Broncos registered a decisive win. He brought his best hook hands to the played. stadium today. If they think they'll pick up it's right a miracle they, they let him off, through security. They could lose this game. But I was really surprised by the attitudes of the players in this week's practices. They were all very focused on the game. Thanks, Ron. The referee is at midfield with the captain. Why would that be surprising? The Shouldn't they be focused on the game? The visiting captain will make the call. Captain, what's your choice? He called Tails. Happy uh, two-year anniversary to uh, both Animal Crossing, New Horizons, and Doom Eternal. Seattle wins the toss and elects to receive. I just saw that on Twitter. Wanted to shout that out. We're waiting for the kickoff. March twentieth, twenty twenty. Right as everything was falling apart, Nintendo said, hey, we got Animal Crossing. We're here. We got you. Nice he run back here for back Seattle. A lot of people overlook the importance of special teams, but it's one third of the game. The kicking team got the upper hand on that play. Caldwell wrapped him up. First down, Seahawks. First and ten. Gannon looks for a receiver. 
McAllister, failed to make McAllister the with the uh, incomplete pass the there from Rich no Gannon. Excuse. Joey Galloway, actual Seahawk on the, the Seahawks. Seahawks. Both of these teams looking looking to get into the playoff uh, the playoff picture. Second Not 100% how Seahawks. it works now. Um, because I and I, I say this every time, every week, just as like a as a reminder. Uh, there is no there is no berth for automatic or there's no automatic berth for division winners a fantastic play here by seattle they just overran and missed touchdown the tackle seahawks. touchdown seahawks deuce McAllister with a 76 yard route from the flat to the end zone look at this just a simple little out and up and gone you'll see a defender come in here number 24 just took a weird path and here are the defensive starters for denver It'll be fuller it looks like I thought he would catch him, but just cut too far behind and missed the opportunity to get the tackle. So that'll be the Denver defense who we saw for a blink. And Seattle, just like that, 23 seconds into this game, has a 7-0 lead. The kick is on its way. And the kick is good. You know, one of the other big sports Denver events this week is a uh, sport event. Off. Probably the biggest sport event of the week uh, this week is March Madness. I love it. The I haven't watched any of it, but air. I do love it. All kinds of basketball, college basketball Number going on. You got the, the NCAA tournament, both for the men and the women. That Baylor men and women had a bad weekend. Yards. Both that of those teams got upset. Uh, Randall Cunningham. Ways for score. That was Smith. He made He's the, the quarterback at for the, 21. You're looking the at Denver the Broncos. Offense for the Broncos. Uh, and then you have both the men and women in the National Invitation Tournament, it's the NIT, down. which has some of the uh, teams that you know did make did make the NCAA tournament, but still, Back still ahead. good. Cougar, <laughs> Washington State Cougar men. Uh, still alive in the NIT. The Cougar women lost yesterday by 10 to end their, uh, end their season. They had a great, they had a great run. Both, uh, both Cougar basketball teams performed, uh, performed very well. So congratulations to them. Sure. It was a disappointing outing for, for the women, but I believe it was the first time that they had made back-to-back -back tournaments in history or something like that they really really did a good really did a good job so congratulations to them Ooh, we have a big run off the left side here for denver neither defense really wanted to play today they said no thank you defense overrated first scoring pretty good first and ten Gonzaga survived a very close game yesterday, from what I, from what I saw. Uh, I didn't watch it. I was playing uh, this week's Sea of Thieves up on Thursday, YouTube.com/slash/Thomas So you can check that video out. Uh, I kind of forgot about it because I was gonna watch it, and then um, we had a really good Sea of Thieves run. It was it's very entertaining. I I think it's one of the better, one of the better episodes. I mean, hey, look, you're gonna put out. A video a day, right? Not all of them are going to be gold. You're going to put out 25, 30 Cunningham parts in one series. Sometimes one episode is just not going to be as good, you know? Every once in a while it happens. It's not that big of a deal. doesn't mean you're a bad content creator or anything. It just means this one just wasn't as good. Uh, this one, fantastic. Fantastic episode of, uh, of Sea of Thieves. I got super into that. I think we started playing around, like... 6 p.m. We didn't stop until we like had to stop because we needed to go to bed at uh, about nine. So it's, it's about a three-hour video, so which has been I think it's been a real sweet spot. It's kind of limiting myself and saying like, okay, barring you know, uh, 
barring full playthroughs of games. Good examples of those would be the, uh, Man in motion. um, like the how uh, the uh, the dark pictures. That's what I'm trying to think of. The dark pictures. Those are like four hours to get through like the whole thing. So those are good candidates for a, a video that's longer than three hours. But I think limiting myself and just saying like, okay, I'm gonna create content that's around like a a three hour block. Do you want to watch this or you want to watch the Batman? You know, that sort of thing. Which one would you like to have on as your background? So we had a we had a really good run. Cunningham turned into a defender. He he was free and clear. Look at all this green, and he just ran right into a Seahawks defender for no reason. First down, Denver. First and ten. But that'll be a, that'll be a good episode. So I, by the time I was done, the uh, the game had completed. Intercepted. Cunningham throws an interception to Eric Allen. Wow. These guys are being way nice diving interception there by Mr. Allen. And Seattle will get the ball uh, back with a minute. Help your team. Just over one minute left in this quarter. The drive begins. Pardon me. Uh, with a minute and three to go here in the first quarter. Gets the ball. Managed a short gain. Small gain before he got tackled. One or two yards, maybe. Second down, Seahawks. Second and nine. That's a good looking drive for the Broncos. A good response drive, but just a bad interception throw makes the run into the defender even worse because he had such a lane. McAllister got tripped up in the backfield twice and finally goes down. That was tragic. That was weak. Couple more divisional matches coming up for you later in the day. We'll find out who's in first place of the uh, AFC West, the team, uh, the division that these teams are currently residing in. Uh, we will see Seattle move over to the NFC West next year. So we have a big bomb down the right side of the field. Receiver got in great position, but into triple coverage. Still hard to complete a pass. Good defense there by Denver. Um, so we'll see the Raiders and the Chiefs. They're going at it later. And that'll be the end game, fourth and final game. But before that, we will head to Lambeau for the first the time this first season period. to watch the Bears That's and the, the Packers, score. two teams in the uh, in top of the NFC Central. Denver had the ball for um, three minutes and 33 Seahawks. seconds, came away with nothing. Seattle obviously had the one big play that gave them a 7 nothing lead after one quarter. The kick is away. I would expect, yeah, Calls fair catch a fair here. Catch and makes the catch. Matt Turk, one punt, 47 yards. Let's see if we can find some scores here. Oh, anyway, to kind of finish up the thought, Finnish Sea of Thieves uh, was First floating around down, on Twitter Marcos. and saw people kind of First tweeting about it a little bit, and I kind of had to do some digging. Turns out Gonzaga Three down five. by uh, <laughs> 10 at half. Battled back, won the game by four. So we'll see what happens uh, for them. Gonzaga made it all the way to the uh, a, to Second the championship down, game last year, where they fell to Baylor. Baylor got eliminated yesterday. Three, five. Man in motion. Cunningham is going. Cunningham to had a lot of time, but a good he coverage sack there. Yards. That was a nice play for by the, the Seahawks. They just closed the quarterback down. Let's see. What is going on in the NCAA tournament? Uh, let's see. Ooh, Wisconsin lost to Iowa State today. That's an upset. Congratulations to Texas Tech. Thank Fourth you for down, taking out Broncos. Notre Dame. I am uh, very appreciative of that. 
We have a couple of games going on right now. TCU and Arizona tied. Purdue up by four on Texas, a team I didn't even know was in the uh, in in the tournament. Quick rundown of today's winner winners: Houston over Illinois, 68-53. Villanova knocks out Ohio State, 71-61. Duke by nine over Michigan State, 85-76. Wisconsin, as I said, fell 54-49 to to Iowa State. Texas Tech, like I said, 59-53 over Notre Dame. Auburn knocked out Miami of Florida. Oh, I'm sorry. I apologize. I read that backwards. Miami of Florida, not to be confused with Miami, Ohio. The U... 79-61 winners over Auburn. And then, like I said, we have two games running uh, right now. Next action looks like is it gonna, or looks like it's going to be on Thursday. Arkansas taking on Gonzaga. Texas Tech and Duke. Houston is waiting to see their opponent. Michigan and Villanova. I'm expecting the offense to pick up the first down on this play. But if they don't make it, they have to understand the defense Saint is going to get a huge surge of I confidence. believe that's a 15 seed is in the Sweet 16 after a couple of big wins for them. To the line of um, Man, that was horrible effort by the offense. Who did they... Honatooth made the tackle. He brought him down at the 40. They beat Murray State. Murray Fourth State, down, I would assume, is also a... Uh, an upset winner as well. The Not to like going to throw shade at them away. or anything. What did I say? Murray. Murray State. The kick is uh, away. Thursday. Number 83 calls for a fair catch. Now that type St. Of Peter's took out Kentucky in overtime. Sheet, but let me tell you what. The defense knows about it. That was great coverage. Oh. Murray State beat San Francisco. Interesting. First down, Denver. I do think I think there were a couple of uh, a couple of at-large bids that got taken away. Like obviously, conference tournament winners they get an automatic automatic bid. Some teams that wouldn't have made the field into into quadruple coverage. What ended up being. Quadruple coverage. Seattle playing well here. We they, we don't usually see Seattle playing all that well uh, in this in this game. I think we've had them a few times. They've always lost. Good to see them playing well, at least defensively. They had the one big explosive offensive play. First down, Seahawks. Still holding on to that seven nothing lead. I forgot. 100% forgot what I was Runs it. He found room to run. He picked up seven yards. It's it's just gone. Second down, Seahawks. Second and three. Go, McAllister has the ball. Gonna not quite get that first down. Should see a measurement here. Or maybe not. Just kidding. Play has been stopped here in the first half for the two-minute warning, warning here for the first half. Down, Seahawks. This first down should be relatively easy to pick up. But then again, there are no gimmies. Third down and two. Add a two-minute warning. Love the fullback run that call a right nice there. That's a big 10-yard gain. That was a smooth run for a first down. It's first down at the 42. First and 10. Pay attention when I'm talking to you. If you like sports, stick around. We got more sports for you later tonight, 7 p.m. Pacific time. You can catch another game of Mariners baseball. Uh... I, it's in it's in MLB the show 12 or MLB 12 the show whatever whatever you want to call it who cares doesn't matter um I don't know who we're playing it's a really weird cover all the other covers have like you know bona fide like stars or whatever MLB 12 for some reason 
Like, doesn't even look like it's a real player. Let me grab the thing. Robinson. It covered 14 yards. The guys made that play look easy. Gannon just went over 100 yards passing in this game. It like, I mean, First maybe down, it does. Seattle. I don't know who this is. First and ten. Uh, who's this Red Sox player? He's going to throw it. The pressure gets to Gannon. He is sacked. You can blame that sack on the who offensive line for not blocking and the receivers for not getting open. Nothing on the inside. Timeout called by the visitors. Two timeouts left for Seattle. Second down, Seahawks. Oh, there's an online pass. If you need an online pass for MLB uh, 12, the show, there's no, like, reversible cover or anything. It's just, it. just a random... Incomplete. Just a Boston Red Sox. Who knows? It's been fun going through the, uh, the MLB... Uh, show games as uh, Mere seconds remain in the first half. as the new Third one down, nears. You know what I, I meant to do actually? I meant to look at the achievement list. Man in motion. McAllister runs it. There's a flag on the play. Holding against the offense. Third and twenty-eight. No gain. Or fourth and eighteen. Fourth and eighteen. Seattle trying a field goal here. The kick is on its way. Kick is easily good. good. Denver seems like that a place a nice where it kick. would be. They needed to get something going in that drive. That scoring drive covered. Place where the uh, defense would want to, or the the offense would want to kick from a little further back. Denver is waiting for the kickoff. Oh, interesting. There's, the There's an achievement in MLB The Show 22 for an that inside the park home run. It's a touchback. That kick covered 70 yards. That boy got some serious leg into that one. First down, Denver. First and 10. Values are... Uh, achievement values are wild. He's looking to throw. I actually have played 22 MLB The Show 22. It's an incomplete pass. Uh, I think I've talked about it. But uh, the the tech test happened, and usually they have very strict rules against you. Streaming, recording, doing anything. Second they plaster down, your name Marco. all over it, so you can't really, like, doctor it. Down. You know, to, oh, that wasn't me. Looks like a passing that sort of thing, or cover Broncos. it. Uh, but this time around, they were fine with it, I guess. The quarterback drops back to pass. Oh my goodness! The see, the see what happens when they the play. Uh -huh. they dance so around. Hard, the quarterbacks hard. dance around the, the anyone, I guess anyone in this game. The players, the the, the AI pathing, they just dance around, and then nothing down, comes Broncos. of a. Uh, It should have been Four maybe some kind of game. For the Broncos. Oh, also, someone got a timeout off, I guess. One second to go here before the half. Nice open receiver there. Not going to do a whole lot of good, but hey, it's good for the old stats. That'll take us uh, to the end of the first half. Seattle up 10-0. After their opening drive, touchdown and kick it a field goal before half. That's it for the first half with our score 10 to That's 0. I think it'll be easier next year to find interesting playoff games um, as we wind the season down because I, I know the rules a little better. Uh, total offense for Denver 69 Denver yards. For the Perfect. Kickoff. Stop it right there. Akers kicks the ball. Jefferson I almost have MLB The Show 21 completed. I was thinking that about was worth maybe maybe yards. if I have some time. Bad decision by the return man. He should have stayed in the I should try and go in. I don't know how long the March to October 
The drive Stuff begins takes. at the 17. First and 10. Like, I have no idea linebackers for the defense. how long that would be. There's a walk game. Yeah. Huh? The quarterback keeps the ball. No gain on the play. Look at the defensive guys strutting around after the play. You know, they like that. Shade wrapped him up. Second down, Broncos. It's second down. Black idiot! Pittman has the ball. There's a few of them that are locked he to the March nice October. Run. He picked up eight yards. A couple of achievements that are locked to March October in MLB The Show 21. I'd like to complete the game because that'd be kind of cool. I have seven. 790 of the 1,000 available gamer score. Uh, according to True Achievements, which is connected to my Xbox Live, uh, 329 hours. Which I think might be a little bit much because I think sometimes I did leave my my console on. But still, that's that's absurd. That is absolutely absurd. Excited for the show 22. That's a uh, regular season should start on April 1st. Uh, there will at least be a gameplay video in MLB The Show 22 on the 1st, uh, be it at either 6 a.m. or 1 p.m. And I think even the, I think my, the, uh, the tech test might be up that morning. And then the, the regular game later in the afternoon, maybe? Afternoon, evening, sometime. I need to, so in MLB, the show, 21, the achievements I need to get, win a World Series in March to October, win a Division Series in March to October, win Home Run Derby, that one should be easy. I'm walking here, record eight or more team walks within a game, and then uh, Fast Track which is in March to October fast track a prospect by earning a boost in a minor league player lock episode third down Broncos third down Three, five. man in motion <laughs> Cunningham into double coverage, a third he defender. Oh my goodness. A third defender came into the, the area. Four for nine, 77 yards, yards, tipped and received, the or caught by the receiver, and they got obliterated on that. My goodness. Sorry, Dick, that's not going to get it done in the NFL. First down, Denver. First and 10. Looks like a passing set for Denver. Black idiot! Cunningham is going to pass. Well, that's going to end up being for negative balls. yards with you know, the way that ball was thrown. I don't even bother to run that play. But I'm sure the defense liked it. Second down, Broncos. Second and 13. The Broncos line up in the I formation. Black idiot! <laughs> Cunningham looks for a receiver. Looks nice like he might be able to boost the, the I'm walking here. That's a momentum builder for the offense. Shade made the tackle. I've also read that you First can get that in uh, not only Road to the Show, but you can also Early get it camp. in March to October as well. So I don't know. We shall see. March to October is a mode that kind of scares me because there are achievements in it, which is nice. But uh, I don't do super well in the clutch, as we've uh, learned over the last Second several down, days of Broncos. MLB The Show. I am so thankful that uh, tomorrow I'll start recording games in MLB The Shows that don't have the stupid pitching meter. I hate that pitching meter. I hate it so much. That should have been an interception. Third down, Broncos. Come on, Broncos. 
It's third down. We gonna bring your man. <laughs> These camera angles are so weird. They're going to throw. Towards the back of the end zone. The incomplete. incomplete. Field goal is still something worth picking up here for the Denver fourth Broncos. Down. Put Broncos. them down by a touchdown. It is fourth and eight from the, the ten. Looks like they'll try a field goal. It's in the air. It's good. Denver and Seattle showing the kickers of Cleveland and New England how to actually make field goals. Uh, you put the ball through the uprights. Wow. 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 We're waiting for the kickoff by Denver. The kickoff is in the air. McAllister starts upfield. He brought the kickoff back 20. Bowled over a defender. Smith got tackled. And that'll be a nice, uh, nice return. The drive begins at the 32. First and ten. Oh, I have to create a Diamond Dynasty team? Gross. Seattle lines up in I formation. Go, <laughs> Gannon looks for a receiver. Ian Badejo oh, caught so the pass. Weird. The play covered eight the yards. The whole thing is so weird when they're just running and back the other way. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. But that's okay. 10-3 our score here in Denver. Down, Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you're enjoying. We'll wind it down the third quarter of this game. Two more pieces of action coming your way after uh, after this. Looking forward to it. I am Badejo. Great last name. Down. Fantastic last name. The third quarter is over. The third quarter is over. Nine twenty. The First Denver Broncos have Seattle. three points and have had the ball for First over ten. nine minutes. Who were they? The current Green Bay Packers starting uh, offense? Oh, but I'm sure. Gannon drops. Galloway makes the catch. A couple of receivers in the area. The that one defender was chains. caught between and uh, caught short. between both Second of them. I was worried that was going to be an interception, but. It was not. Second down in inches. Man in motion. He's looking to throw. The ball hit him in the hands, but he couldn't hold on to oh, it. Oh, he He's dropped it. He I thought that was a completed down. pass. I I did not realize that he dropped it. But it, it did look like kind of a weird animation. But I thought, there's no way. There's no possible way that he inches. dropped that ball. Third and inches. I formation. Go, McAllister runs it. Oh, that was a very long handoff. The defense there. forgot to lock the gate. He made a nice run. He picked up 11 yards. The offense knew they could get enough yardage to wow, pick up the first a, down. A lot more yards football. than they needed. Obviously nice run by Seattle. Didn't. Keeps the drive first alive. Keeps Seattle. the clock moving. Winding to first under. Uh, or down to about the or, oh my gosh, Sean, please windy down to the four minute mark. Man in motion. He's going to throw it. McAllister makes the catch. I like the find the there. McAllister just doing everything for yards. Seattle right now on the this drive, running McAllister. the ball, catching the ball, dropping catches that he should have caught, but then also getting the first down anyway. So it's not that big of a deal. He probably Second he's down, probably going to come out and try Hawks. and kick the field goal. Gannon float pass wow. up there. The Defender was in a great the position, but instead it'll be a reception. A first down, first down for like Seattle. Threw that one. Homeboy made a sweet throw. First down, Seahawks. First and ten. Go, 88. <laughs> Ian Badejo 
Wolf with the ball. That play went nowhere. There was no game. All right, give some props to the defense. They were all over that one. Claiborne wrapped him up. Second down, Seahawks. Second and 11. Seattle doing an excellent job here, milking the clock. Downfield. Very excited for them to throw Brown in a complete pass. The, catch. the pass was caught, but it went for no gain. Timeout. timeout by the home, by the home team. team. Denver still Denver. has two timeouts. Hey, that's Third a good time down, to, to take a time out there. On a second down and 10 completion, you get no gain there. So third down and 10. Stop the clock. You're likely going to end up down 10 here. You're going to need as much time as possible. Should see another timeout after the five-yard uh, five gain. You can't hold me, fool. You can't hold me. Fourth down, Seahawks. Oh, actually, you know what? Take it down to the 200 line. I apologize. That's me having poor clock management. The kick is on its way. Should get the two-minute warning after this. Kick is good. 13 to 3, our score here. Seattle has scored the touchdown, obviously, on the very drive. big play yards. out in the flat in the miss uh, miss tackle by the defender on Denver's side. He had, he really had a shot to get that to get that uh, Seattle is get that tackle, but overran it. I guess just ran it incorrectly. However you'd like to phrase that. Actually going to be two Adrian minutes and one the second ball. on the clock. So Number Denver will get the ball. The ball and starts up field. Receive it. Working it up field towards the, the 30. Just short of the 30, yards. but still a pretty good game. For today's final two a couple of warning. interceptions have really helped Seattle, especially on that first drive. After Seattle scored... Cunningham the threw the interception the to a diving Seattle defender to stop a defender to stop a very yeah, nice Denver there. drive. You better not try nothing cute out there. Black, idiot. <laughs> it's a pass. Okay. Randall Cunningham is going to find some room off the left the side, run over a defender just for fun. But it's all coming back because there's going to be a hold. It's going to be on the offense. And it'll be first down first and 20 down, from the Denver 18-yard line instead of first down and 10 from the Denver 44. Huge swing in Seattle's favor. Personally, what I like here, uh, I like not that. I don't like that. I like, hey, let's get into field goal. Let's kick a field goal. Let's make it a seven-point game. Got a couple of timeouts. Try an onside down, kick. Broncos. You need both of them. You don't have great field position after the uh, after the after the penalty. So take take the three because you need you need both either way. Shorten your own field. Maybe get maybe pin Seattle deep. Get some good field position. Then try to cash in for the touchdown. The Broncos will go with five receivers on third down. Though I do think it's tempting to get the, He's I would argue the, the touchdown more difficult. He makes the catch. Uh, I don't think a lot of people would argue against that. I don't know who's thinking touchdowns are easy. That's all you got, man? Just over one minute left in this game. Fourth down, Golden Broncos. Six. That that penalty killed Denver this drive. Go for it on fourth down. Cunningham drops. That is going to be short of the line to gain. We've got first down going the other way. Seattle is going to get the ball. They'll be able to kneel it out. There's no reason for Denver to even take the timeouts because they are down by too many, uh, too many points. Great defensive stand by Seattle. Obviously aided with or by the uh, at the 37 by the Denver penalty. Denver. Without that penalty, would have had a first and ten at that 44-yard line. They didn't even get back to that 40, that 44-yard line, with all those plays that they ran. Was how, such a good run, such a wasted run. He picked up four yards. 
Kearney made the stop. Timeout We're going to actually get timeouts here from Denver. Denver. Still has one timeout left. Mere seconds remain in this game. Second, Second down, Seahawks. Press A to kind of speed this along a little bit. Man in motion. McAllister with the ball. McAllister with a great run right there. Nine yards. That's good. As long as they don't call down. a timeout, we should Excellent. be all right to just let it run. But for whatever reason, they call the timeout. Timeout called by the okay, team. Don't do that. They have no timeouts left. First down, Seattle. Should be a kneel down here. 34 seconds to go. Quarterback we'll take that. Denver's out of timeout, so they can no longer stop the, the clock. Thank God. Best play. Second down, Seahawks. Second and 13. This game is over. The final score, 13 to 3, Seahawks. Fans on the screen now is the winner of the There's Wilson your Game Ball. Player of the game, Sam Shade, one interception, four tackles. Did lose a yard on the interception return, but and hey, now, no Taco big Bell deal. I thought I muted my camera or muted my microphone instead of my, just my camera. Here's your Taco Bell highlight reel. We'll pop out of this game. We'll hit it with a spicy save. Take a quick momentary little break. And then we will uh, jump in with more action from, I believe, Oakland and Here's a look at Green stats. Bay. Take that. Reverse the ordering of those. Well, this one is over. And on behalf of Ron and myself, thanks for joining us. Be sure to come God, back Denver soon and play 158 NFL yards Fever offense, again. 69 rushing yards. Noise. 89 passing yards. A couple of turnovers really doomed them. But uh, hey, that's how it uh, that's how it goes. So that'll give Seattle a little bit of a leg up in the race for one of the AFC uh, playoff spots. And we'll see who leads ends up leading that division a little bit later tonight. We are going to go to Lambeau uh, in just a moment as the Bears head. Uh, head on in. Chicago won the game in Chicago. We'll see if Green Bay can exact sub revenge and not not suck. Uh, they got Elvis Garbuck. Garbuck? Gar Garbach. Garbaggio as the quarterback. So we'll see that next right here. YouTube.com slash Honosaurus Rex. Stick around. Just a very quick little intermission screen so I can get up, get a drink, all that good stuff. Uh, feel free, pause the video, stretch, do what you need to do, grab another snack if you need it. Thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you so much for watching, uh, or if you just have this on in the background, I appreciate that too. Uh, remember, if you don't want to hear my voice and you want the video to play because you appreciate that I'm doing it or whatever, whatever your reason is, you can always just mute the tab on your thing, let it play out. I still get the watch time, so there you go. Uh, pro tip from me uh, to you. Thank you again so much for watching. Be sure to scroll down, subscribe, ring the bell if you haven't already. We'll be right back with more football right after this. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the show. We're going to jump into uh, Bears Packers. Hopefully, you took that extra couple or those few seconds while you looked at Peyton Manning throwing a football and you uh, subscribed, rang the bell. Make sure you noti were notified for new videos coming up. Once again, big shout out to OBS Welcome to Green Bay. for allowing me 69 degrees. Noise. 9 3 Chicago Bears, 8 3 and 1 Green Bay Packers. Coming out to you live from Lambeau, Digital Lambeau. Uh, How you doing? Ron, who are the players you love being able to pause a live difference. video recording Looking for so it's not just like a big chunk well, here's your guy. of like extended this stuff that either needs to be cut out, which I don't have the op option like to do because my computer doesn't work pass. correctly. When he's on, or just Alex left in. Is as good a passer as any in the league. Among active NFL quarterbacks, he has All right. 
highest winning percentage. First time we've been to Lambeau this season, we've seen Green Bay play, I, I want to say, all their division opponents. I don't think we've had the Packers playing anybody other than division opponents. They tied against uh, the Bucks, which is why they have that 8-3-1 and one record. They lost to both the Vikings and to the Bears when we saw them in Chicago. So we'll see what uh, this game uh, what this game brings today. Two teams with good winning Chicago records. And, to and here we go. Chicago is waiting for the kickoff. Number six boots the ball to start this game. Milburn looks for running room. He brought the kickoff back. Big run back yards. for uh, Melbourne, near the, near the 35 yard line. So Chicago will have good starting field position. I don't know that we've the seen Chicago begins. outside of the, the matchups against Green Bay. I'm sure that's wrong. I think we watched Chicago play Minnesota recently. I seem to have also lost. Oh, never mind. My caller. Found my pen. Don't worry. Drops. Oh my goodness, what an interception. This is going to get returned inside the 20. Down to the 10, 5, a touchdown. An interception return for a touchdown by Patrick Sertan to start the game for Green Bay defensively. First pick in this game for Sertan. First pick of this game, first play of the game. Here are the starters on offense for the Packers. The Bears were in weeks 5, 10, and 12. Bears played the Vikings. Bears played the Packers. Oh, Bears played the Falcons back in week five. So there, the there you have it. I got to update these numbers. The Rams have definitely been seen since week six. They were in uh, last good. week's last week's action. Final three weeks of the regular season. On your screen are very, the names of the very exciting. For the I believe season one of this will end. Hey, Pat Tillman on the Chicago Bears defense. Uh, I believe this season will end on May 3rd, so uh, when that rolls around, happy birthday to my to my dad. I know how much you love football. You know, I could play a Fifth Element video game for you. Not going to. Green okay. Bay will put the I'm just ball not going to do play. football instead. The kickoff is so Green Bay air. just kicked off, and now they are Number kicking off again with a seven nothing lead. Field. We've had more kickoffs than actual offensive plays. Another great return there by the uh, the Bears return man. Past the 30. Got just crushed. Tim Couch. Ricky Williams. Richie, the fullback. First down, Bears. And I'll have a first and 10 from the 31 yard line. Good start for the Packers here in green and gold. Couch is going to pass. Nice pickup. That's a much better throw that time. The defense needs to start getting in the quarterback's face. He's not nearly as accurate if he's running for his life. What are you talking about? We've seen him not be accurate anyway Packers. because he threw an interception. They got returned for a touchdown. Whatever. Whatever. First down, Bears. First and ten. Three, 43. What, what? They're going to throw. He makes the catch. The pass went for a gain of five yards. The receiver was Brady. Brooking made the tackle. He brought him down at the 48. Let's uh, let's pull up some NCAA down, scores here. Kind of keep an eye on that. Second and five. Next video I think will end up being recorded before the next round takes place. My goodness, the Indiana Pacers, 129, the Portland Trailblazers, 98. Wild. Almost as wild as that catch in double coverage. A diving grab. We'll get the replay here between two defenders. Tim Couch find a, finding a little bit of a groove. Pretty 
Purdue up on Texas, 65-56. It looks down. like the other game went final. Maybe. Back formation. There was a second game going. Huh? Williams is looking for room. Chicago didn't fool anyone that time. No gain on that play. What a great play by the defense. The stop was by Brooking. Second oh, down. I'm sorry. Arizona Bears. is up three on TCU at the half. That was my confusion. I was like, there were two games happening. Very, very confusion. He drops back to pass. It's dropped. The big event for me An personally this pass. week, though, as it's far as uh, sports are concerned, Devontae like Adams has been traded to the Oakland or the Las third Vegas. Down, ooh, shoot, Bears. the Las Vegas Raiders. Oh, excuse me. Um, and that is uh, that is a bummer. The writing was a little on the wall there. Uh, for, for me, at least, they had talked about Derek Carr and Devontae Adams, who both went to Fresno State. They had talked about. Linking up again, playing in the pros together, um, and and doing that sort of thing, and I thought, okay, you know, that's that's why last year felt like such a farewell tour for me, not just for Aaron Rodgers, uh, but also for Devontae Adams. I figured, hey, you know, who knows what Aaron Rodgers is going to do? Aaron Rodgers doesn't even really probably know what he's going to do. He's getting all the attention he could ever need from this, so you know whatever he'll he'll do what he does and i thought you know what maybe this is a good time to transition like say goodbye to the sure to be first ballot hall the of famer say goodbye the to the if he keeps it up hall of fame caliber Devonte adams um and usher in a new era with uh with jordan love and some of the receivers that they have the couple of good running backs a pretty good defense i think even if and I've said this before, uh, as we have a holding well, penalty here, first and 17 for Green Bay first coming down. up. So that's Green a bad Bay. start for them on offense. Thankfully, their defense got off to a really good start. I think that even if you have Jordan Love as your quarterback, I think Green Bay's roster is good enough to still be the favorites. I think that's more of a uh, more of an indictment of how bad the rest of the NFC North is over, like, a, I believe wholeheartedly in Jordan Love sort of sentence um and i thought honestly i thought keeping Devonte adams in Second green down, bay would Packers. be a big swing to try to get aaron Rodgers to stay and you know maybe vice versa as well like hey we're gonna have aaron Rodgers. you don't have to worry about a rookie or third year but first year starting quarterback um nice find out here getting near the first down marker slips a defender should be a first and ten the defense better find a way to take that for Green Bay right around the 22-yard line. Uh, obviously, that didn't work. They franchise tagged Adams. He said, "I'm not playing on the franchise tag." Totally agree with it. First down, like, Green there's Bay. no real, there's no reason to all. All you, there's not a lot to gain from it. You have a lot more to lose than you have to gain. Like, yeah, sure, you can go absolutely berserk, He's going to throw it. have an incredible season, do this, that, and the From other thing. That, I thought, was this an interception. Instead, a it's a big, long touchdown Next for the Packers. The end zone. Go, Pat, go. He made a tough play look easy. He went all out to catch that pass. This replay. I, oh, okay. It kind of looked like the uh, the punt blocks that we see a lot, where it's like, oh, that looked really close, but then it wasn't. 87-yard drive, and that was even with a big penalty on first down. Green Bay scores, and they are up 13 to nothing. Most of the time we've had the Packers on this show, it never seems like they should have the record that they do. This is showing a little bit more of a flash of why they would be 8-3-1, and and we have seen a couple of those losses and that tie on this, uh, on this or during this series. Um... The kickoff is in the air. Milburn so, starts upfield. You know, you'd have, like that I said, first year starting quarterback, third year in the league. Yards. Give him receivers that are good, that have experience, but, you know, and no shade to them might not be in the same position if they were on a different team. I, I, you know, again, I think the roster is still good the enough to at least be competitive for an N NFC Bird North crown. Um, I, 
I don't. I, Justin Fields is interesting in Chicago. I don't believe they fired their coach. Uh, Matt Nagy has the Detroit Lions playing really well, but they feel like they're probably a year or two away. Um, and then the Vikings fired their coach and Kirk Cousins is their starting quarterback. So, ooh. I, yes, Kirk Cousins has led Minnesota to two, three, two or three playoff wins. He's a good statistical quarterback statistically he's a good quarterback um, but I just don't you know whatever what um, they decided to do a big long extension or maybe they, I, maybe not long but they signed him it doesn't matter so it is a little surprising to see man in motion it's surprising to see Aaron Rodgers stay and Devontae Adams go. There were two receivers, by the way, that could have caught that pass. I thought we would. I thought Green Bay. I thought we would see either both or none, not half and half, and certainly not this half and half. I thought maybe we'd see Devontae Adams on Green Bay without Aaron Rodgers. For like a year, maybe two, if they made him like a lucrative enough deal. I think the most interesting thing about all of this is how the uh, the Packers' two biggest names on the offensive side of the ball were both connected to AFC West teams. And I get that Adams' relation is more personal because they played together. But it is, uh, it's, uh, I think it's just weird. Just weird. AFC West is going to be an awesome division to watch. Uh, we're going to see a lot of those games in prime time, and I am totally fine with that. Totally fine with watching Mahomes, Mahomes, Herbert, uh, Mahomes, Wilson, Wilson, Herbert. Throw some Derek Carr in there. Um, who's the other quarterback? The officials have stopped the clock for a measurement. I think I think I covered all of them. I think I got all of them. Still a lot of time left in the opening period. First down, Packers. First and ten. Should be exciting. AFC is going to be the powerful division, or the powerful conference, I should say, for a while. A lot of good young quarterbacks. Will throw. Not much there on that Russell Wilson's play. not even that old. But between like between game, Josh all Allen, uh, all four AFC West quarterbacks, uh, the what's his name? Second Joe Burrow, down, Packers, Lamar Jackson. Who am I forgetting? Probably not forgetting anyone. I mean, that's still seven quarterbacks that are like, wow. That's incredible. First has the ball. Anyway, run off to he the left side. Nowhere no to go there. That Looked like he had a little bit of a gap made the tackle. through the through the line there, but elected the not to take it. Instead, Third no gain. The we'll wind down the Bucks end of the first quarter. Green Bay up 14-0. Two throw. big plays the in the first quarter that. for the Packers to so get them to touchdowns. The interception like return on the very first offensive play for Chicago. And the big bomb down the left side that I thought might have even ended up as a pick but instead went for six. Green Bay, 104 yards, all of the them Packers. through the air. Because Green Bay, Green Bay still have, should have Aaron Jones. Uh, they signed Tanya, Tanya, Robert Tanya. That's a great defensive play there by, by Chicago. Just took him too long to get rid of the ball, sent one too many defenders. Fourth down. That'll uh, that'll end it for this drive. Fourth, Fourth and sixteen the from the thirty-six. The ball away. Green Bay will kick it away. The kick is away. Tanya. Am I saying is I think I'm saying Johnson his name right? Robert Tanya. That punt covered forty-three yards. One year deal. Hopefully he can get back into his uh twenty twenty form. He was injured last year, I believe. The drive begins at the 20. 
First and ten. Chicago lines up in I formation. Blue, 16. Richie runs it. He picked up six yards. Second down, Bears. Second and four. Red, 48. Williams with the ball. Third down, Bears. For their sake, I hope the offense doesn't overthink the play call here. They need to keep it simple and just uh -oh. pick up the first down. Ooh, gross. Hopefully that doesn't cause a, an overload of my encoder. Running off the right side here. Into three Packers defenders. None of them can get him down. ran for a gain of 13 yards. That was an outstanding run for a first down. Just incredible. First down, Chicago. First and ten. I was curious if there was a release date for Man in Motion. He makes the catch. The pass was release date for Brady. Ooh, Jack it was a gain of seven yards. Hell yeah. Certified fresh on Rotten Tomatoes. That's right, baby. Second down, Bears. And delivered on or shortly after release date. <laughs> when, all right. For the Bears. When's the release date? None. Okay. Great. Thanks. Thank you. Oh, the no. Incomplete, the incomplete pass. That should have been a pick. I thought that was going to be an interception, but probably landed on his down, landed on his Bears. elbows before for his sake, toes touched. I hope the offense doesn't overthink the play call. Journal for they Jordan. Need to keep it simple and just move the chains. Oh, my views. That's what I've looked at. All right. Oh, good. Spice World. All right. Why did I look at that? Is that a vial? That was a gain of 14 yards. Gain of 14 Johnson yards. Just knows how to get open. Hey, you need some help, man? This is out. First down, Chicago. Street date March 8th. Oh, it's been out for a couple weeks. Okay. Uh, format. <laughs> yeah, Kesha's high road on vinyl target. What are you doing? Why have I not bought this yet? That was the two-minute warning. Why you stop for the two-minute warning? Uh, oh, okay. Just, yeah, they have Second Spice down, World on vinyl Bears. for some reason. Sure. Okay. <laughs> I looked at it. Apparently, I don't remember looking at a journal for Jordan. But I maybe I looked at it and it didn't have a date or something. Somebody go back to my own video. Oh, my goodness. That is pass interference. How is that not pass interference? He tackled that man. Green Bay's playing off, Third playing down, off all the refs. Third down. Title just has not been released yet. Doesn't look like we're going to get a 4K edition of, uh, <laughs> of this. Probably don't need a 4K a version of it. It's a really good movie. Really, really good. Fourth down, Bears. Fourth down. He's averaging just over 30 yards per punt today. I was actually, I was surprised at how much. I'm maybe not surprised at how much I enjoyed it, but how like how consistently good it was. That you know, goes into like Jack has always has bits. It's return. always like That's that, like touchback. like an album, you know, sort of thing of just like, ah, eh, some stuff's better than others, and like I'd skip this the or I don't like that or whatever. But like. It's like it has such a good, likable cast, fun guest stars, uh, and none of the bits were ever like too long, or in my opinion, really all that gross. Jackson picked up two yards. It's a good movie. It's a, it's a very good, it's a very good, movie. and it's half as long as uh, as the Batman. 
which is wild to think about. And it sounds like, because they were talking about it on, um, I get a lot of Wild Ride with Stevo clips in my, how was that caught? How in the world? All right. Um, he had Preston Lacey on, and they were talking about there is a forever and a half, or 0.5 or whatever. And from what they were talking about, it might end up at down, Netflix or something, which is uh, interesting. But that'll be that'd be pretty fun, you know. I I when I walked out of the theater, I was like, I'd like more footage. I don't know if I'd want to watch it. I don't know if I need like a big sweeping three-hour ultimate, you know, jackass cut or whatever, but. Having it be like, okay, here it's in, it's in theaters, in February or whatever, it's right around Valentine's Day, uh, and then having it six months later with like another eighty-five to ninety-five minute smorgasbord of footage, absolutely, absolutely. He picked up five yards. Because even in the credits, there's like a bunch of stuff that they, like. <laughs> Second down, Packers. They had like footage of, and there's even the a couple of times where like eight. people Our are score, wearing specific outfits, zero. like Green someone's wearing like a cut off like t-shirt or whatever in the background. You're like, oh, they're setting up for something else, and it just never happens. Oh, all right. Chicago is ready to kick it. Uh, second half kicking off here. By the way, this is going to go out of bounds. This is, I, I believe it's an illegal procedure. There's the kick. That will draw a penalty play. That wasn't even close. There's a really smart... I, I like watching um, at the 40. compilation videos of like... Uh, lately it's been like baseball Single stuff of like formation. one pitch away game tying or game winning home runs or whatever. It's like, oh man, how, how close. That sucks. Uh, speaking of things that are off by one pitch. The series on... Secret base, Captain Ahab. Fascinating. Fascinating. I think I I might have talked about this last week. Second down, um, Packers. But I uh, I watched episode two, and, and it just Split back. the way they write that, the way they talk about it, the way they like just the way that series the dorktown stuff is done is like i think they have three of them that are in the longer form sort of content they did the the seattle mariners one which was at three and a half hours overall over seven parts they did the falcons one and they're and they're doing captain they have they have a bunch of other like dorktown stuff that is like kind of one-off but these are they're more like hey this is a multi-part series where we're really diving deep into this stuff they make me care so much about stuff that I never even knew about. Where, like, the Atlanta one, the, the best example of the it was the Atlanta one, where they're talking about a running back um, who was desperately trying to get, like, a thousand-yard season. And he, he, like, he'd been getting close a couple of times or something like that. And then he eclipsed it, and then they gave him the ball again, and he lost three yards and ended like four yards or uh, two or three yards short or something like that. Maybe it might have been a bigger loss. And then that was it. He had like, I think he had like a thousand and two yards. Ran it backwards for five a five yard loss and ended at like nine ninety seven. Amazing in this league, Dick. You know, it's and just the way that they explain that whole situation. I'm sitting there of, for a, an event that I have not heard of, but I don't know anything about, rooting for this guy against the team that I love, just being like, look, Green Bay, I understand. You want to win this game? You're probably terrible because this is like the mid-80s. Maybe. Uh, maybe it was the 90s. It, I don't know. It doesn't matter. I think it was right around the early 90s. Because I think that was in the same episode where they were talking about Brett Favre. No, it's not the point, though. And just having me just go like, God, I hope he gets it. I hope he gets it. Oh, there's an interception for Chicago. Green Bay was working on a magnificent drive 
down the field, and they could not come away with points. Made the stop. First pick in this game for Miner. Now that's how you help your team. Inside their own 10, it's first down, Bears. First and 10. Yeah, just the way they do that is just... God, it's so... Three receivers in the game for Chicago. It's, uh, it's incredible. Uh, but going back to what I was originally talking about... Um, Williams has the ball. Uh, he found room to run. He picked up five yards. Thomas compilations that I watch. Sometimes it's like really smart plays or one million IQ plays or whatever. And there's a really Second interesting down, one with... A very weird rule in the NFL that Randall Cobb exploited as a return man for Green Bay. The team kicked it. It didn't go out of bounds, but it like, oh, there's an interception. But it was like skipping towards the out of bound line, but might have, like was returnable. And if the defense had gotten down there, the return coverage or whatever, the, re the kick team had gotten down there. That's what I'm trying to say. And they touched First it, they would have been able Packers. to recover it. But because Randall Cobb put First one foot out of bounds and touched the ball, that was an illegal procedure. I was like, wow, what a bizarre... I think that was like a knowing your rules. It doesn't matter. Man in motion. But I was, I was thinking about that it's as that pass. kick went unbelievably out of bounds. Incomplete. How was that not intercepted? Who was he throwing to? There was no one there. Second down, Packers. It's second down. So with this, let's say Green Bay holds this for the next six minutes, 48 seconds. I believe it'll put them in first place. They'll each have nine wins. Chicago would have four losses, whereas Green Bay would only have three. They have split the season series, or they will have split the season series. But Green Bay has the tie that might actually give them a little bit of a bump and give them a shot at the division title. Um, we'll also get a lot of division games at the end of the season next year, which will be great because there was a big problem with that for a while. And I, I said that it might not actually be for, for a bit. Um, because they wanted the games to mean something at the end of the season, which would actually directly affect a man named Matt Flynn uh, later, because there were a couple of times where, like, teams just basically took Week 17 off. You saw We saw multiple years of the Indianapolis Colts taking, like, Weeks 16 and 17 off because they were, like, they were perfect. And they're like, we have all what we need locked up, taken care of. Whatever, no we're good. That was a touchback. Um, and then, uh, then they lost in the first round. But in order to spice up the final week of the season, which is, I mean, to be frank, spicy enough, first they wanted to have bears. rivalry games in there, or you know, teams in your division that you really first didn't like, bears. to try and encourage you Chicago to like with one play right well. You had Green Bay playing Detroit. Williams is looking back for in it would have been like 2011 2012 the somewhere in there the uh Matt Flynn threw for six touchdowns against Detroit Green Bay had a down, big Chicago. long streak of victories against Detroit um I, I don't think Detroit had won a game in Green Bay for in motion. 20 years 25 years or something like that Williams or in Wisconsin because the they played this that's how long the streak was the streak was so long that it was just in the state of wisconsin because green bay would play games in milwaukee every once in a while and then uh yeah that, that, that's wild green bay unfortunately anyway so they did that green bay played very well they uh traded to seattle they traded matt flynn matt flynn got a big old contract Lost out, lost the starting job to Russell Wilson, and then kind of like just bounced around and left the league. Ended up, I think he ended up back in Green Bay later, like a year or two later, uh, to back up Brett Favre. Had a great tweet the other day. <laughs> remember that? Remember when you got like a bunch of money? And you just quote two with like, "Hell yeah, that was awesome." Third and four. 
Green Bay is one of the teams that will be facing uh, facing off in England. I don't know exactly where, but they'll be overseas. That pass was and that is going to be that's going to be that's a big deal for a lot of for that entire town. That Green Bay was one of the last holdouts because they just didn't want to give up a home game uh, because it brings in so much money to the local economy. And Green Bay more so than any other sports, maybe even franchise in the United States. Like. Williams needs gets that a nice gain of six yards. I forget what the exact number. I think it's Second it's like down, multiple Bears. millions of dollars. Second and four. That might have been like throughout a season. But each team gets a bonus home game. He makes the catch. Every other year, and I think I think that's when you go like, okay, you have, I I, for, I think there's like a every eight years or something you have to go across, like go overseas or whatever. I think that's where you go like, okay, every every other year you're gonna have an extra home game, but every like fourth one of those extra home games is gonna be gonna be overseas you know like, like don't cut them down to seven here. home games just cut them back to the regular eight since you've extended the season by a week because you clearly clearly care about player safety when you're you know extending the season for a week you're very concerned with the product that you're putting on the field uh, because resting isn't already a problem in a bunch of other major sports including basketball where a little girl got very upset because Baker Steph Curry, her favorite player wasn't Mitchell playing. So he like hooked him up with tickets to a different catch. game. That punt covered 41 yards. It's a huge issue in the NBA. It's already annoying in the NFL. It's Aaron Rodgers only played half of the game against Detroit. Cool. You're telling me the that if Green Bay the runs 10. the table earlier, First sooner, Locks up what they need to lock up. Not going to be a problem. It's not just exclusively Green Bay. I was, you know, is Indianapolis did him. Oh, Gerbach deep down the left side. That's a huge play into Bears territory inside the 40 yard line. Man, I love that. First down, Green Bay. It's going to be, it's going to be an issue. It's going to hurt the product. The Packers bring out the three receiver formation. It's going to cost players a lot of, you know, cost players money. We're going to see a lot more of that, like, oh, man, nice run off the right side. We're going to see more players probably taking rest weeks. He covered 24 yards. Number 20 is big. But hey, whatever. As long as you get your money there, NFL. Don't you worry. First down, Packers. First and ten. Ugh. The quarterback drops back to pass. Huge pickup nice for Green find. Bay. He got that stopped just short of the goal yards. line. Timeout. Timeout by visitors. Chicago. Chicago still has two timeouts. This has been all Green Bay. Even when Chicago got a couple of bounces their way, they still were not able to capitalize. I thought he threw an interception. 50% of his catches have been touchdowns. That scoring drive covered 89 yards. 89 yards and like three, three plays accounted the for most of it. Lines up to kick the extra point. It's up and it's good. The kick was good. We're waiting for the kickoff by Green Bay. Number six kicks the ball. Milburn looks for running room. 
He brought the kickoff back 21 yards. Oh. What's going on? What's coming out? What's coming out this week? The drive begins at the 31. Oh. Interesting. Sonic the Hedgehog. 4K. Like it's like You're a gonna cool pass. box. You got to neutralize the pass rush bonus the stage play. edition. He makes the catch. The pass is complete to Williams. Looks like it's be a book. The best part about steel books is when they put like copyright paramount. The officials have stepped in to give the two-minute warning. Two, minute warning. two minutes left in the game. Second down, Bears. Uh, mini steelbook with digital code, original poster code to comic Second down. This is the like most ginormous photo. This is so unnecessarily large. Couch is going to pass. What the heck kind of pass play was that? They lost yardage. The stop was by Brookie. Oh, interesting. So you get the regular 4K Blu-ray. What the hell is happening? Third down, Bears. Sonic the Hedgehog? Not a bad movie. Am I going to see the sequel? No. No, no, no. Not, uh, not happening. Ooh, do, 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 do. Is it the 22nd this week? Anything interesting coming out? Incomplete. Oh, Eastern Promises on 4K. It's a... Hell yeah. Give me some of that 4K Vigio Morgenstein. I have not no watched... I think I watched that movie here. once. They will go for it on fourth down. I remember it being good. But I don't... I don't know. The fourth down conversion attempt came up short. We've got it feels like an interesting down, movie to go back and way. look at. Not for forty dollars on four K, but they got a Blu-ray of it, probably First cheaper. Down, Green Bay. Oh yeah, half the price. First and ten. The Packers line up in the I formation. Silver eighty-eight. Man in motion. Of course, I may have just been so enamored with the uh, the shower room fight scene where you're just like, oh look at this cool. It's because like the movie comes out, it's 2007. I'm 17. All this stuff is like new, you know. It's like, oh look at this big fancy R-rated movie that I'm watching. Whoa, cool guy alert! Look out. Uh, maybe doesn't hold up as well now that you're now that I'm 32 and have been able to watch kind of just whatever for years and years. The, the novelty would be worn off. Of course, First I enjoyed down, Jackass Packers. forever, so who knows? Who knows? Oh, Nightmare Alley is out this week. Interesting. Man in motion. They, re they re-released that movie in black and white, which I think is, uh, which is interesting. Definitely a novelty, definitely a gimmick. Something that we've seen with timeout. other uh, other that was their acclaimed movies. Out. We saw it with... Second and inches. I want to say there was like a trailer for Mad Max Fury Road in black and white that was like so so big and popular that they were like, yeah, we'll make a black and chrome edition. Who cares? Just over one minute left in this game. Third down, Packers. Third and four. They're going to take their time not before a whole lot snapping coming the ball. Of course, I'm not as up to it. Up to the minute on the movies. As uh, as I normally would be. Or maybe even hope to be. Is that John Goodman? Nope, sure isn't. It's a different John. It's uh, John Cusack. I love, uh, one of the things I enjoy about, like, looking at, like, Blu-ray release dates and Blu-ray.com or whatever, it's just, like, these weird movies that, like, big name, like, name recognition stars are in when they're, like, well past their, uh, wait, are they really kicking a field goal here? They kicked a field goal at the buzzer for no reason? That's what you like to see. That scoring drive you see these recognizable actors yards. in like a bunch of garbage. Just like movies you didn't even know existed. They did for like a million and a half dollars to show up on We're set for, for two and a half days. Green Bay. 
Green Bay kicking off. off is in the air. I Number muted my camera because I thought that the, the clock hit zero. Instead, uh, we get this. One last play, 24 to nothing. Your final. Green Bay, uh, a team that has not looked good on this or uh, during this series. They look like a team that, that should have a good winning record. Some fireworks from the Packers. Big to plays to get them up 14 nothing. A uh, nice big explosive drive to Ron extend the lead to 21 nothing, and then kicking a field goal at the end just for fun. Two Sertan. interceptions for Patrick Sertan. 35 yard, uh, 35 yards in returns. The one the touchdown. Reel, I think it was three tackles. From this game. That's the second touchdown Green Bay scored. Put them up 13 nothing or 14 nothing. There's the interception. A look at the that was one of the breaks that. Chicago got, but they couldn't That's return the it because they threw Thanks an interception in. so uh, on me, their own. Pretty even time of possession. We'll Green Bay obviously dominating the total NFL offense Fever. yards. Two turnovers for Chicago, both of those uh, uh, interceptions to one guy. Green Bay throwing the interception there in the game as well. Uh, I'm going to back out and just make sure that uh, get a save here. Save, yes. Boop, boop. Okay. Succeeded. Last but not least, Raiders, Chiefs coming up here for you. To end the day, they both lead the AFC West. Who gets first place? Who gets second? As the final three weeks of the season Welcome approach Oakland, every Tuesday here right here. Uh, we get a 64-degree game Raiders. here. I was hoping for a snow game in what's it called? NFL player, Ron Pitts. You know, I gotta tell you, dude, Lambeau, Green Bay, that place we Ron just were. Tell us the players to watch in this one. Here's a guy that can disrupt any offense when he's on the field. I wouldn't be surprised if we ended up hearing his name called a lot today. The man is a player. Randy Moss is an extraordinary Randy Moss on the uh, on the Raiders battle of first place teams. I'm getting targeted ads for baseball cards. Don't need them. I'm gonna click on them. Games are often decided by just one play, which was the case when these two teams met earlier in the season. The final margin was less than a touchdown and a PAT. I opened so many could tabs. play a role in who wins this. So many. I'm tabs. expecting another close game. Thanks, Ron. The referee is at midfield with the captains for the coin toss. Visiting captain will make the call. Captain, what's your choice? He called tails. It is heads. Oakland wins the toss, and he likes to receive. This game is underway. That's a touchback. The ball will be brought out to the 20-yard line. What a All booming right. kick. Touchback to start the game. The drive Not that exciting. Not a great 20. start. This game's bad. We'll just skip it. Just get rid of it. Hopefully they might have some information on. He made it back to the line of scrimmage. Uh, what's it there called? was no game. Now that was cold blooded. The... First degree defense. Fields wrapped him up. You're looking at the starting offense for Oakland. What's it called? Uh, the Batman. Nothing on the Batman. Looking forward to checking that Second one out. Down, Raiders. No, uh, no real extra sports topic here. I can, let's check these scores the in the NCAA tournament. Three Second down and 11 coming up here for Oakland. Looks like uh, Arizona up by eight at the moment. 66-58, 752 remaining in that one. And Purdue took out Texas by 10. Eighty-one, seventy-one. If I didn't finish that uh, that score. Third down, Raiders. 
It's third down. You better have eyes in the back of your head. Collins will throw. Tough break for the quarterback. That ball was dropped. You know, a drop pass helps the defense almost as much as an interception. Fourth down, Raiders. The offense is set to punt the ball away. The kick is away. Schrader calls for a fair catch. All right, Schrader. So after the 45-yard punt, the no return. Peyton Manning the on the field for Kansas City. Denver Bronco running back. Oh, my gosh. The traitor. The traitor who didn't have any option but to be a traitor, First an in-division in traitor. Because it was a random, what's it called? Fantasy draft. That's what it's called. Hone in on today's game. That today's finale, that's going to be an incomplete pass in to start off the drive. Not a great start, obviously. Here's Terrell Owens, the, the big name for receiver the for Kansas City. We have our uh, final game. Hey, thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it. After this, obviously, we'll get you all the scores caught up, uh, standings, all that good stuff. Maybe get some stuff set up for the ten. next week. Or for next week's games, which again, every Tuesday, but I gotta alter my schedule a little bit. Normally, I record these on Sundays, which I probably need to just move them to a day off anyway, because three hours is a long time after working. You know, covered ten yards, tackled by But if I move this to like a day off, you know. Three-hour commitment, First not so down, hard. Kansas City. So, uh, yeah, this one, next one will probably probably be recorded on the 23rd. So I don't know exactly what sports news is going to break, obviously. But uh, if something exciting happens and you're like, oh man, what's he going to talk about this week? And I don't talk about it. We'll get to it the following week, which will be April uh, 5th when that video posts. Got to work this. Got to work this series around a trip Second down, Chiefs. so that makes things a little a little trickier it's not, I mean honestly the series isn't it's not bad to do you know three hours that's about the length of the other videos and stuff it's now that baseball is going to be a consistent thing that is where it's like uh oh that's four and a half hours Throw that in with, uh, like, a Life is Strange on, like, a Wednesday or whatever. When you got Third more time. Third and eight. New Sea of Thieves one. Adventure. Starting this week. Blue Excited man. about that. First one, pretty good. He's going to throw it. The pass was I don't really know what decisions we would have made to, like, alter the world, but... Whatever. I'm not the one in charge of it. Fourth down, Chiefs. The Blue offense tip. is set to Fourth punt down. the ball away. <laughs> Berger gets the kick away. That'll be a that touchback. Goes into the end zone and will not be returned. That's a touchback. Mitch Berger. The drive begins at the 20. Oh, interesting. I, I didn't realize uh, Spider-Man wasn't on physical yet. It's just digital. Right now. Done. Ooh, the, the humans is coming out so. He picked up five yards. That is a cast that like I was like, oh, it's a lot of people in this movie that I like. God, I'm really worried that I'm like just over two minutes overloading the encoder. I shouldn't be clicking around all this stuff. Big throw down the left side. He's got a man open. 
Receiver got turned around a little bit. His first completion, one for three, got 38 yards. Has Kerry Collins always been the quarterback for the Raiders? First down, Oakland. Let's find the answer in the notebook. Not the Ryan Gosling movie. Put that movie on 4K, Coward. Collins looks downfield. The pass was caught, but it went for no gain. I would Two, exactly three, nine. A perfectly executed oh, no, play. That was Gardner. He made the tackle at the 36. Four and 11. Second down, Raiders. Second and 11. Oh, it was. It was, okay. was Kerry Collins. Interesting. Collins I've only seen the Raiders twice. This is their, this is their third the appearance in the series. So that's, that is actually kind of a surprising, he made the tackle uh, the surprising stat. Kind of. I think the Raiders, the Bills, and... Third down, Raiders. The, the Browns had a couple early, in the zone coverage. but like not a ton. The short game. And I'm sure the, the numbers will be a little, you know, there will be some teams that will probably end up only being on once or twice, but their records were terrible, and they weren't great when they were on, so. Third and inches. The safest play for the offense here is to run the football, but the defense knows that. The offense may be able to bust was, uh, them with a big pass here. A24. Oh, a All right, April 19th. I have to keep, uh, keep track of that. The officials have stopped the clock will I? For probably not. Even if I buy it, will I watch it? Short, uh, probably not. Oh, now. looks like uh, Jackass Forever actually has a an April 19th date, according to Blu-ray.com. So it's a good thing that I looked at this. So I can go buy Jackass Forever, obviously. Delightful 90 minute We've comedy. Or I can quarter. buy this no score. Uh, the the family quarter. drama based on a Tony a Tony Award winning stage play. Is that what it said? Four Tony yeah, inches. Tony Tony Award winning play. So like you know a little something for everybody. April 19th on Blu ray. <laughs> the kick is up. The kick is good. good. He made that look easy. Ryan Longwell. Longtime Packers that kicker. Pretty sure he went to the Vikings. I should put them up by three. We're waiting for the kickoff by the Raiders. Just starting the fourth quarter here. Boy, I've really gotten sucked into this hole. Longwell gets his foot into the ball. Blu-ray release stage. Trader starts upfield. Win a date with Tad Hamilton. Who remembers that movie? He brought the kickoff back Not me. Yards. Topher Grace said, no, I'm done. I am done making that 70s show. I'm going to go make hit films like Win a Date with Tad Hamilton and Spider-Man 3. That dude's probably the laughing his ass off all the money the he made. First and 10. Saucer is the runner. That was a short gain by the fullback. Kansas City finds themselves down three nothing, and I find myself with it's two movies down. to purchase on They'll April nineteenth. At the thirty-five. Second and nine. I don't know how accurate the Blu-ray release date, Blu-ray.com release dates are. It's weird that they had it, but like Target didn't. But, uh, they sent a couple of extra defenders there, chased out of the pocket into a defender, absolutely crushed the Raiders, looking good defensively. Third down and 13. As the clock winds under, four minutes to go here in the first half. A very attentive host is enjoying these football games. Hopefully you are as well. Manning will throw. Manning nope, into the area where there were two receivers. Found the receiver short of the first down marker when there was a receiver looking like he was springing loose, going past the first down marker. 
Peyton Manning, don't know if you know this, but you need to get past the yellow line that's only visible on television. Or they have these little things on the sidelines, the chains. Bam, that'll tell you where you got to get. Just a pro tip for you, hot tip. Burger gets the kick away. For you, Mr. Peyton Manning. Sanders looks for running room. That punt return covered six yards. First down, Oakland. First and ten. Collins looks downfield. Incomplete. Thought that was going to be intercepted, honestly. Second down, Raiders. Second down. The clock's been stopped because there's a penalty. Interesting. No, uh, no Cooper today. Second down, Raiders. Second and 15. Man in motion. Damella gets the ball. He found some running room. He picked up five yards. I even had to double check what day it is. I was like, it's Sunday, right? Koopa goes live at 7.30 on Sunday. Third down at the 24. It's now like 9 p.m. Where is he? He drops back to pass. They are going to measure for the first down. It's first and 10. First and 10. Man in motion. He drops back to pass. Wow. Uh, we and might have a pass a interference here play. or a hole. Pass, pass interference, though. So. Damn it. And this but crowd the correct is letting the referee know they didn't appreciate that call. First, First down, down, Oakland. I mean, I am shocked that the... It was a very similar play in the Packers game earlier that just didn't get called. So that was, uh, that was interesting. That was a pitiful effort by the What am the I Olympics. looking Evans for? Wrapped Gotta him find up. my Life is Strange video. Went up uh, yesterday or today. Tomorrow. That's sorry. the two minute warning. Yesterday Can't when you're watching it, gotta get, get that prepared for warning. tomorrow. Down, Make sure I have it. It's there. Don't you worry. Working through Second three more episodes of that uh, that their Life is Strange remastered game. I was actually hoping to have that done by the time that I would He's go on the trip. The not going to work he out. Oh, a fumble. Recover Kansas City's going to recover. He's going to trip a little bit. Uh, it's not going to be enough to get him stopped or down. Touchdown, Kansas City. A couple of defensive touchdowns here in these last the two games. The receiver just laid there. Am dead, not move. the offense will kick the extra point the kick is up and it's good the kick was good so just like that 7-3 Kansas, Kansas City is ready for the kickoff Murray gets his foot into the ball Moss has the ball and starts a field. That Randy return Moss returning kickoffs. Is that just me or is that weird?
The drive begins at the 24. First and 10. I formation. Collins will pass. Collins finds an open Dunn receiver. The pass. Not quite the enough for a first down, yards. but a good gain and a good timeout start to this drive. By timeout Oakland still by has Oakland. Two timeouts. Second down, Raiders. Second and two. Three down linemen for the defense. Collins looks downfield. Oh, that got the ball beautifully deflected on a diving attempt there. Fantastic defense by Kansas City. That'll set up a uh, third down. Third down and short, I believe. Third down, Raiders. Third down and two. We'll get the A button press. Seemed like it was one word that was a little stuck. Oh my god, wide open down the middle of the That's field. The see of him until he's touchdown the Raiders. What a nice play for the Raiders. That touchdown pass was Three receptions, 105 yards, and the touchdown. And the Raiders take the lead back. 9-7 extra point pending. Minute and a half to go here for Kansas City to get something on, on the, the board. In response, the attempt is on its way, and it's good. Next big movie I'm very excited about: Everything, Everywhere, All, at Once. We're A movie I'm so excited about I can't ever rem remember the title of it. Um, man, I I can't wait to watch that. Longwell it's gonna be in ball. playing in Seattle while I'm in Seattle. Schrader has the ball and starts. I just don't field. know when it would get anywhere else it says like yards. april 8th everywhere but i think it's like exclusively at regal cinemas which is kind of dumb because even in seattle the only First one is a regal Kansas that's like City. way up north First and i was like looking at it i'm like i really want to go to this movie but i don't know if i need to make that much of a trek to it is going to pass that was a perfectly executed play not we just got nodded that was a great play not second and ten kansas city second down neither of these teams wow just a big old big old shot of that the quarterback drops oh, back to pass. My goodness. The pressure gets to Manning. He is sacked. Boy, it scares me to see a quarterback go down like that. He really took a shot that time. Navy gets to the quarterback for the second time today. Obviously, the offense needs to Neither of these teams seem to be playing very efficiently. Timeout called by the visitors. Kansas City still has two timeouts. About one minute left in this half. Third down, Chiefs. Man in motion. Manning will pass. Oh, they get an easy play He's right back. He had he got turned around, but it what didn't nice matter. Second time we've seen that where it looks like it's going to be a really easy reception. They get good distance behind the defender, but then they get turned around. You think ah, maybe that'll slow him up. It does not in this case. So big plays exchanged here between Kansas City and Oakland. And we will uh, await the extra point. The offense lines up to kick the extra point. The attempt is on its way. And it's good. Couple of lead changes here late in this second quarter. Still a whole 61 seconds to go. Kansas City is ready to kick it deep. The kickoff is in the air. 
Number 24 starts up field. The kickoff return oh, just short of the 20-yard line. I wonder what this return man is going to say to his special teams coach when he gets to the sideline. The ball carrier was brought down by Davis. First down, Raiders. First and ten. Oakland lines up in I formation. Collins will throw. There's a marker on the field. Are we gonna have a holding penalty? This was a really late holding penalty. That ball was long gone. Uh, it seemed when that uh, that penalty marker flew out. That'll do some damage to the Raiders field position first and 19 that was actually a pretty nice play good completion out to the right side you see Oakland trying again floating it over to the left side incomplete pass second down and 20 coming up as neither team really wanting to run the clock down both teams would like incomplete passes and timeouts to make this take as long as possible second down Man in motion. It's a pass. He makes the catch. double coverage. The it's going to be tackled, I think, out of bounds. The receiver was Moss. Third down, Raiders. Third and one. Is going to pass. Incomplete. Oh my god. Just some completed passes, some runs, maybe. Really appreciating Cleveland and New England the right now. Is nearly over. Fourth down. Raiders. This this last two Touchdown minutes has taken so long. Second punt of the day. So long. More. I know that that game. Even with away. the overtime, I think the Cleveland and New England Schrader game is going to take less time than this. Catch. They were efficient. They were throwing passes and catching them inbounds, keeping the clock moving. All right. We got a ticking time bomb called My Tiredness. And I feel it winding down rapidly. First down, Chiefs. First and ten. Blue ten. <laughs> He's looking to throw. He makes the catch. Manning found an open man, and it was good for a gain of 11 yards. Number 81 is an excellent athlete. First down, He's so, such an excellent athlete First that we don't even have his name. Single back formation. Blue 10. Hot. The quarterback drops back to pass. That should have been the an interception. That defender was in perfect position to pick that pass off. Second down, Chiefs. Second down. Red 29. Interesting decision to run the ball this late in the second quarter. Oh man, did I hurt you like that? Third down, Chiefs. Now, Third see, down this is and the kind of seven. Situation where your Looks like they're going to just take it into half of the four point lead. Kansas City, a couple of touchdowns pass. late in this second quarter. Anderson has the ball. Oh, Anderson bowled over a defender there. I think they'll run out of time, which is unfortunate because they actually got uh, close to field goal range. Maybe That's just the, the very of outskirts the of it. Quarter. Either way, we That'd are done with the, the first half. Quarter. Because of some interesting decisions there from Kansas City at the end of uh, that. Uh, that Kansas City is part of the game. To the interesting game. doubling the interestingness the is the fact is the that air. Kansas City 
gets the ball first. McDaniel so a good opportunity to roll. double dip on some points, push the lead to seven, and then kind of go from there. They'll just do you, nothing. I the man was absolutely, absolutely nothing. Crazy to bring that ball out of the end zone, but hey, he made it work, and now his team's got great field position. The drive begins at the 25. First and ten. Single back formation. Blue ten. Man in motion. Hut. Anderson with the ball. Anderson off the right side. Gonna hit the uh, about the 30 yard line. Decent run. Second down, Chiefs. Second and six. Man in motion. Punch out, or kick out to the left. There for Anderson. Great play by the defense. Rudd made the tackle. Fifth tackle in this game now, recorded by Rudd. Rudd. Third down, Chiefs. The offense needs a big chunk to it's move the sticks down. here. Now they could try and run it, but I'm guessing this is going to be a pass. Red 29. He's going to throw it. He makes the catch. The officials have stopped the clock for a measure. They don't need to stop the clock. Just let it go. And it's short. Fourth and let it run. Berger is averaging over 40 <laughs> yards go. per kick today. The kick is away. Sanders calls for a fair catch. That I think in today's NFL, we would actually yards. see them go for it, especially with, uh, with Kansas City, Pat Mahomes, and Andy Reid. It's first and ten. First and ten. We're gonna be on you, baby. It's a run. Run off the left side. He had so the much room. He had all the room he could ever need to spring a big oh, run like all the way if he just broke it to the boundary. But instead down, tried Raiders. to run. Right, right through basically the blocker and the defender. Try to split that gap. There's not much of a gap there. It's not designed for you. Collins looks downfield. Collins finds a receiver who got to behind the defense there. It was an all-out blitz by Kansas City, so it was going to need to be a quick completion. That's exactly what the Raiders got, and a touchdown-saving tackle perhaps by that Kansas City defender. Looks like the defense is using a 3-4 front. It's a pass. He makes the catch. They're going to measure it. He's going to be short and by short. Second inches. And inches. Second and inches. Collins will throw. That's a first down Interesting decision to throw it. Kind of threw it off his back Moore. foot and made the, the receiver run to toward himself. the ball. That was too easy up front. It's first and ten. First and ten. The clock's been stopped penalty. because there's a penalty. False start. False start against the offense. Punch the microphone a little bit. Sorry about that. First I keep doing it, but this this cord is on my is in my headphones. I don't know. I wonder if my headset's starting to go. Man in motion. Dead's probably not the right the word, but I don't. I wonder if it's holding pass. a charge as much as it used to. Unless he trips on one of those strings, uh, wow. he's gone. Wow. Similar to a play we saw from Seattle. Nice play by the Raiders, and that'll uh, give them the lead here in the third quarter. That scoring drive covered 78 yards. Mm. 
The kicker has come on for the extra point attempt. The kick is up, and it's good. The kick was good. Should be good now. My headphones should be good. They're fully charged. It says they're fully charged. We're waiting for the kickoff by the Raiders. Illegal procedure on the Longwell kicking team. Kicks the ball. It's not even close. The what are you doing? It's first down at the 40. First and 10. So 17-14 our score now. Oakland taking the lead back. Love that little flare to Dunn. The quarterback drops back to pass. I got tipped and picked. That is going right back to the Raiders. Was by wow. Great defense by the Raiders. Get those hands up. You can't get the sack. Get the hands up. Bat the ball. Good things happen. And Carpenter. He gets the reward, an interception. First down, Raiders. First and ten. Two, nine. It's a pass. He makes the catch. A short gain on that pass to Moss. Tackled by Evans. That's what I'm talking about, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Second and eight for Oakland. Second and eight. Also, shout out to everybody uh, subscribing. Thank you for subscribing if you have. If you have it, consider it. But uh, over 800 subscribers. Oh, I thought... I Initially, I thought that was going to be a touchdown pass right there. Then I thought maybe interception. Instead, just a deflection. Third down, Raiders. That'll set up third down and eight. Feels third absolutely down. wild. We were coming up uh, about 11 months ago. Um, I hit Brandon my first Moses. 100 subscribers, and it has exploded to 800 to plus. Wild. Short gain on that pass to Camilla. Uh, now, stop me if you've heard this before, That's what I'm but... What is the computer doing? Why is the routing in this game so bad? It's like they get the ball and they just hit all the buttons on the controller at the same time. The punt is in the air. That punt goes into the end zone. City will get the ball at the 20-yard line. That's a touchback. First down, Chiefs. 26 seconds to go here in the third quarter. Tight game for the lead in the American American Football Conference West. I was thinking baseball, American League versus National League. And then I realized I wasn't doing anything with baseball. And I got very confused. Threw myself off. Second down, Chiefs. See uh, if we get one more play off here before the end of the third quarter. We will not. The Raiders head into quarter number four with a three-point lead, 17-14. It's been a pretty good set of games. The Packers game, not great. I mean, great for me because get out of here, Bears. Get out of here. But the Cleveland New England game, very good. The Seattle Denver game, pretty good. This game has been, uh, has been great so far. Let's see what the fourth quarter has in store. It has in store for us a first down for Kansas City. First down, Kansas City. Oh boy, I hit a wall. Holy moly. First and 10. Kansas City has a man lined up in the slot. Man in motion. Pitch out to the left side. Picked up a nice block. Sprung him free. He'll be inside the 40 in Raiders territory. Kansas City ripping off a 20 plus yard gain there. 24 yards, I believe the commentator said. First down, Chiefs. 
First and ten. Very excited for this game to go into overtime and give us an extra five minutes. Some more missed field goals, our second tie of the day. In before commentator's curse. He's looking to throw. Peyton Manning throws back across his body. Had a better target kind of doing the, the angle thing. He was running across, and it just went to the guy coming back behind him. That sucks. Second down, Chiefs. Second and five. Blue 10. Manning will pass. Manning, big throw. That should have been intercepted. There were Rudd. five Raider defenders in the area. That Peyton Manning got away with that. That should have been. Oof, should have been easy pickings. Third down, Chiefs. Third down. Quite literally on the uh, pick portion of that. Blue 10. Man in motion. He's looking to throw. That pass was good looked, for a gain found a receiver. Yards. Not enough for the first down. Just keep bringing it. Just keep bringing it. Fourth down, Chiefs. Just over three minutes left in this game. Red 29. We're going to get a field goal here. It's up. It's going to be good tie game. We're all knotted up at 17. The score is 17 to 17. 46 yard field goal is away and good. Oakland is waiting for the kickoff. The kickoff is in the air. Number 24 has the ball and starts a field. That return was worth right to the 20. Yards. Not really much of a reason to take it out if you're just getting a regular field position. Just taking on extra hits. The drive begins at the 20. First and ten. Blue nine. Collins will throw. Collins looking. Incomplete. Probably had that route initially. Just a float pass immediately when he gets the ball is probably the better option there. Second down, Raiders. It's second down. I formation. Collins looks for a receiver. Collins found a receiver. He slipped a tackle. It looks like six. They Touchdown. Catch him. Slipped a tackle. Somehow that wasn't an interception. And uh, Randy Moss picks up his fourth catch of the day. Four receptions, 96 yards. Most of it coming on this one, huh? And obviously, the touchdown. It looks like the offense will kick the extra point. It's up. And it's good. The kick was good. Kansas City awaits the kick. All right, halfway through quarter number four here. The kickoff is in the air. Schrader looks for running room. That get up to uh, right about the 20. Same yards. criticism you could level at the other returner. Getting to the same location, just getting that extra hit. Looks like we have a First down, uh, Kansas City. We have a tie game. First and ten. Split backs. Blue ten. TCU and Arizona. It looks like it was so close to being 
throw. Not sure who has. Tough break for the quarterback. That ball was dropped. He must have taken his eyes off that one. Who would have scored? Arizona, I would guess. Second down, Chiefs. It's second down. Kansas City has a man oh my lined gosh. up in the slot. Arizona almost won on a walk-off dunk, but his hands were still on the ball as the buzzer went off. Back to pass. The pass went for a gain of seven yards. The receiver was Conway. Oh, Halo premieres this week on Paramount Plus. Third down, Chiefs. Third and three. We ain't here to take prison. Blue tip. They're going to throw. Deep down the field into quadruple coverage is going to be intercepted by uh, by Oakland. They're going to get into Kansas City territory. It might actually be marked right at the 50-yard line. Too many mental mistakes. He needs to make better throws and smarter decisions. Arizona up three with a little over two minutes remaining here in the er, uh, in the overtime period. I should say. First down, Oakland. First and ten. Do not. Camilla is the runner. Oh, got tackled by the, like the one person on that side the of the field. Of Give the defense truckloads of props. They just killed that one. Tackled by Hicks. The officials have stopped the clock for the two-minute warning. Second 24, down. 24-17. Second down. Two minutes to go in our final game of the day. Ismail picked up one yard. Evans made the tackle. Kansas City needing their defense to come up big here. Two timeouts left for the Chiefs. Third down, Raiders. Third down and nine. Big play here for Kansas City. Big play for Oakland as well. Can they shut the door on a Kansas City comeback? Kansas City, can you get your team back in? Yes, you can. And you'll save yourselves a timeout because you uh, knocked that ball away. Not a great throw from Jeff George. Don't love it. It's fourth down. Moore is averaging over 40 yards per kick today. The punt is in the air. Schrader has the ball Setting and up starts for a return a here. Schrader, Schrader got to the, the sideline, but a nice tackle there to mitigate yards. any damage done. Kansas City will have another shot to tie this game up at 24. First down, Kansas City. 143 to go. Uh, the Raiders with all three timeouts, Single so that's not the relevant formation. information. Uh, I, I didn't catch how many. The Chiefs had. He drops back to pass. There's a flag on the play. Can get another one of these kind of weird Holding late the holds? First down, Chiefs. Ball was getting close to being released. Two timeouts remaining for Kansas City here. Is your medical insurance paid up? Looking to throw. Oh, Manny had all kinds of time. Great coverage sack there. Manny, though he had all kinds of time, not really any uh, good space to go with the ball. So he'll take a sack. That'll set up second down, second down and 28. The clock is running out quickly on these uh, Kansas City comeback dreams. That is not what you're looking for at all. A minimal game tackled inbounds. Burned a timeout. He ended up in front of his own lineman. And that uh, that did not help anything there. Third down, Chiefs. The offense is really in trouble here. 59 seconds to go. That'll get him this kind of yardage. 
I expect him to put the ball in the air, which is exactly what the defense expects. Yeah, third and 27, probably going to go to the air. That, how is that not pass interference? That is pass interference. That's like the third one we've seen today. All right. Fourth down, Chiefs. Fourth and they 27. Points to tie it up. Manning looks downfield. The fourth down conversion attempt came up short. We've got first Not even down close. going the other way. You should replay. I thought that was going to get intercepted, but. I guess no such luck, depending on who you're, uh, who you're it's rooting for. Down. Kansas City, it's one timeout good. remaining, 50 seconds. Timeout called by the visitors. They have no timeouts left. Second that down. should do Raiders. it for that. Skip through a few of these a little bit. This ball game is nearly over. Third and goal. Third and goal. The offense is going to consume as much time as possible. Good game from both of these teams. Good day of football action right here on youtube.com slash Rex. Thanks again so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoy. We'll get to our player of the game. We'll get the uh, the Taco Bell highlight reel. We'll get you the scores, the standings, and then we'll get you the heck on out of here until next week or perhaps a different video on a different day. 24-17, Oakland takes over or should take over first place in Collins the AFC West. Kerry Collins He's is the player of the game. Of the 16 game. for 25. And now, Excuse me, Taco 304 Bell yards. Three touchdown passes. From this game. Bumble return for a touchdown here. Randy Moss breaking that tackle and breaking it to the house. Now on the screen are the stats. 200 total game. yards versus 315. Pretty even time of possession. Our game is over, so 304 passing go, yards to 11 rushing yards. Multiple turnovers for Kansas NFL City, but only fever. one for Oakland. There you have it. The fourth and final game. We will put all these to Sim. Okay, only uh, only the one shutout this week, and that was Green Bay shutting out Chicago. The, the scores go like this. Chargers over the Eagles 20-13. A shocker. The Bengals beating the Jaguars 30-24. The Bucks also won by four, uh, except for 30-24 is a six-point margin of victory. I'm very tired and uh, dumb. Buccaneers over the Lions 24-20. We saw the tie here on uh, or in uh, in this week's video. Patriots Brown 7-7. Patriots I believe have two have two ties this season. Bills and Panthers up in Buffalo 30 to 20 is your score home team wins. Saints crush the Falcons 41-13. Raiders over the Chiefs. We saw that one just moments ago, 24-17, your final. Rams barely edge out the 49ers, 21-20. Vikings up by 11. They take out the Titans. Nope, just kidding. I had those numbers backwards. 31-22 is your final. The Vikings fall to the Titans by 9. Giants all over the Cowboys. Bit of a surprising result. The Cowboys are in... Uh, really good control of the NFC East, but might that control 
not be as sturdy as I think. We'll find out in the standings here in just a moment. Packers over the Bears. You know, 24 nothing. Cardinals taking out Washington, 31-10. Steelers went at home over the Jets, 22-17. Seahawks beat the Broncos, 13-3. You saw that game. And the Dolphins by 7 over the Colts, 17-10. As far as the standings are concerned, the Raiders, the top team in the NFL, the Packers, right behind them, 9-3-1, trailing the 10-3 Oakland Raiders. Four teams with nine wins, including two from the NFC Central, an AFC East, and an AFC West team. And then we have uh, kind of a log jam here at eight. The Patriots have two ties. Unbelievable. So who did... Who did... I have already forgotten. Hold on. The Jaguars. Where are the Jaguars? Oh, wow. That actually is uh that's a pretty big upset. Pretty big upset. Here are your standings. NFC East. The Cowboys still control it, but the Giants do pick up a big win. Eagles five and eight. Cardinals four and nine behind those eight and five. Cowboys. Uh that's a disgusting division. AFC East is a lot tighter. The Bills on top at 9-4. and four. No ties. The Patriots one game or one win behind at 8-4 and four and 2. Jets 7-6. and six. Colts and Dolphins both have 5 wins. One of them with a tie. They tied the Patriots. The Packers take over first place in the NFC Central. They are 9-3-1. and one. The Bears are 9-4. Nine, nine and four. The Buccaneers 7-5-1. The Vikings and the Lions not looking great. The AFC Central is crowded as heck, except for those Bengals at the bottom. 8-5 is your best record. That belongs to the Ravens and the Jaguars. The Browns 7-5-1 after the tie against New England today. 7-6 for both the Steelers and the Titans. And there's the lowly Super Bowl participant Bengals at 3-10. NFC West. Saints on top, but only by a game eight and five, seven and six. The Rams right behind them. Two teams at five and eight, and then the Panthers at three and eleven. AFC West, Raiders ten and three. Chiefs drop to nine and four. Seahawks rise to eight and five. Broncos fall to five and seven. And the Chargers. I don't think they've really been in it very much since the beginning. Let's take a quick peek at some of these schedules here. We are looking for just some good matchups. Patriots, Bills. Might we see the Patriots for the third time in a row? Possibly. Um, Broncos and Chiefs. Interesting. Bucks and Bears. Titans, Packers. Saints, Rams. Okay. All right. We have some good options. What will we uh, what will be on the show next week? What will I pick? You will have to tune in to find out right here on youtube.com slash Rex. You can catch a new installment of the random rosters series. We'll be going through a few different sports games here and there, showing you some videos. The rosters are randomized. We do a fantasy draft. It's a lot of fun. If that sounds like your cup of tea, scroll down, subscribe, ring that bell. Make sure you're notified when I post new videos. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. I will see you next week with more action. Goodbye and go sports.